Up a lazy river where the old mill ran Meets the lazy river in the noonday sun Linger in the shade of what's happening welcome to the channel my name is Kevon the golden and today everybody we will be doing a total for season two reaction of house of the dragon season two of course i already reacted to this this is me just putting this all together so it can be kind of easier for y'all to watch y'all have to be clicking on multiple videos y'all can just watch this all at once uh, let me know down in the comments if you like videos like this and me just jam packing all the reactions through the season together. Um, in my opinion, oh yeah, and if you want to go see the full uncut reactions, I may have cut out some of your favorite scenes or skipped over them. Um, if you want to see them, go on here and subscribe to my Patreon. My Patreon is only $5, ladies and gentlemen. Five bucks to subscribe. You can see four uncut reactions and total full length um but my thoughts on season two let me just give them now i really enjoyed the season i know a lot of people online don't like slower dialogue type season a lot of people got short attention spans and they just want action 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 but i'm a game of thrones fan i'm a House of the Dragon fan. I'm just a Song of Ice and Fire fan. And I know some things at times in this universe can be a slow burn, but trust me, that slow burn is building to something tragic. It's building to something gory or it's building to something beautiful. It's not just going to be the same. Let's just put it like that. I really love this season. Some of my favorite episodes. Um,. One of my fa I had three like favorite episodes that I would rewatch and rewatch this season over and over again. The first one being is when Otto got fired, um, when he confronted Aegon for hanging the um, rat catchers. That was a real powerful, beautiful, and dialogue type episode. Um, if you the type of person that picks sides, greens or blacks, I'm kind of I kind of support the blacks the most, but I understand the green sides at some points. But I mostly support the blacks, and that episode really made me understand Otto's perspective that he's dealing with a bunch of idiots, and it will most likely come crashing down when he's not involved or not around anymore and which it did everybody just started doing dumb stupid decisions from Aegon to Aemon all the way down to Allison. yes um I know we may be happy for what Allison did at the end of the season for Rhaenyra but if you are <laughs> in the greens factions and you loyal to the greens, you gotta say this is the stupidest shit I ever seen in my life. Why would she do that? Um, she don't love your kids. You don't love your son. You don't love your soldiers. You don't love your handmaidens. You don't know what's gonna happen when you let an enemy army into a city. They could sack that city. They could burn it to the ground. Uh, I know she has a lot of trust in Rhaenyra, but let's be for real. They haven't really been close friends since they was teenagers. Um, they spent a lot of time away from each other. I want to say probably six to five years almost. So you don't really know these people anymore. Let's, you, you see each other every now and then, but you don't know these people anymore. When you spend years away from someone, they change. And hey, but other than that, yeah, I really love that episode. Um, seeing it from. You really saw that episode from Otto's POV. If we probably if we doing it like the Bush, that that whole episode is probably from Otto's POV. Just everybody around him making dumb decisions, and you just finally realize, wow, this guy was the glue holding this shit show together. And now he went back to the Reach, and he's been in prison. That's not part of the book storyline. So hey, even us book readers are interested to see where that's gonna go. Um, my second favorite episode was the Battle of Rook's Rest. Uh, Rainey's was a good, very good character, full of sass and spunk, and that attitude and that energy is most definitely going to be missed because at times it brought 
a little bit of sense of humor when somebody just send their line their heart out and then they do the shot of Rainey's just rolling her eyes like really this guy <laughs> so yeah she will be missed and I love the battle of Rook's Grass it really showed that Targaryen badassness that she had deep down in her heart not fleeing from the battle a lot of people say yeah she should have Ran out to Dragonstone to get some more support. Maybe flee the battle after she's staying vague out there. But hey, when you make a promise saying you are going to come save these lords from their castles being sacked, you got to keep your promise. There's no fleeing because if you do flee, they're still going to get sacked. So uh, you got to give respect to Rainies for fighting to the end with honor. Yeah, she burnt a lot of people alive, but hey. It's a war. Don't march if you don't want to die. <laughs> that simple. <laughs> I know a lot of people ain't got options, but when it comes to these high lords, yeah, don't march if you don't want to die. <laughs> and my third favorite episode had to be... I, I just call it the episode when Rhaenyra became a full Targaryen. Because we've seen her through most of the season kind of not doing anything at all when it comes to this war not doing anything at all when it comes to talking to a council and putting them in check trying to teach them to respect her and things like that that episode was very good for Rhaenyra's character because I feel like she's been kind of you know in a bottle all season with the cap on and now in this episode somebody let the cap off and she is free she's like a genie who's free she's finally being her true targaryen self doing the things that she want to do in life and that's smacking that and that involves smacking people that's smart to her that involves finally expressing the sexual desires that she has always had and also when she is confronted with a threatening situation that is a new dragon rider in the air we don't know who that is she confronts that too and rides off on side ass so yes i really loved that episode for Rhaenyra it was just full targaryen to its fullest um the red sewing i'm not gonna sit here and say i like the whole episode together i just liked it when they got to the dragon pit and they started trying to mount the dragons I'm not saying that's a bad episode overall, but that's just the only thing I remember from that episode, the Red Sawing. Um, so, yeah, that was a very good scene when they got to that dragon pit with Vermithor just burning people alive and eating them. <laughs> he did not, it seemed like he did not want to be waked up. It seemed like he was back there cooling with Silver Wings. Cooling with Silver Wing. They was out there making babies back to back, laid up with his wife until right now called them for some BS. To find a new rider. And I also like Silver Wings. Whole little. Thing that showed that every dragon is different. Um, yes. Yeah, sometimes you will meet a nice reptile. And I'm glad we finally saw one. Um, trying to see if I'm missing anything. I'm going to touch on some of my favorite characters. Also this season. My favorite character this season had to be Aegon because I really saw his character development and his growth as a person this season. That was excellent writing on his part. Whoever did the writing for Aegon throughout this whole season, bravo. Thank you. You are so talented because this is a person I just didn't care for season one. I uh, read the books, Fire and Blood, so I had this prejudgment of him. And yes, he did do some horrible, horrific things that can't be forgiven in season one, like Arward and Diana, and seeing like he sexually assaults a lot of the handmaidens and maidens that work for the castle and for House Targaryen. And seems like he's not confronted on that a lot. Allison just deals with the problems when it comes to the girls and yells and slaps Aegon around, just going about her business. Um, maybe sending him to the wall. 
maybe gilding him would stop all this. But, hey, you know, it's her son and she ain't going to do really much about it. So, yeah, I like Aegon as a character because he grew. He wasn't his season one self when he kicked off season two, which makes sense. He has become a king. And you are given that much power. You are going to change. You are not going to be yourself anymore. You are going to be either a very good person to the 10th degree or you're going to be a horrible person to the 10th degree or you already was a horrible person so the little things that you do it seems like you're trying your hardest and that's what i got from a guy it seemed like he was trying his hardest in his deepest heart when he was made king and he had to sit on the throne and make some of his first royal degrees and things like that he tried to listen to the common man. Um, he tried to get his kid, Lil Viserys, in council so he can learn at an early age. Viserys really never taught Aegon nothing about being king or nothing about laws or how to govern the realm. So I like to see that Aegon tried to start his kid off early. Because let's be honest. This is medieval times in a fantasy world. What is he really doing? Kind of too young to be riding a dragon off by himself. Um, he can learn education here at this council, which could really help him be a good king in the future. And I like Aegon involving his kid in that, and I got to give him props. After he got burnt... I really feel bad for him too. I feel a little bit more. Now let's talk about him losing the son because him losing the son is a very understandable man with all the emotions that he had. That episode was very forgivable and understandable. Him cursing Rhaenyra out to the 10th degree is very understandable because my kid has died. And like he said, why are we acting stupid? We know who did this. We know who named. It's a part of this. It's Rhaenyra and Damon's. Yes, Rhaenyra didn't send the hit, but she did rile Damon up. And when everybody, every common person look at this tragic event, they are going to look at Rhaenyra, the queen, the head of this war, and say, hey, she made that decision. It falls on her. I'm not saying Rhaenyra... Is wrong for something that she really didn't have nothing to do with. But kind of did when she called for revenge on Eamon. It's not like they hired some faceless men. Damon went to go find a loyal gold cloak and a rat catcher. <laughs> so yeah. Uh, I really felt for Aegon in the episode. He just really had some very powerful dialogue the episode him yelling saying she's laughing at me she sits across the bay on her rock and she laughs at me just oh just stuff i would remember for a very long time um my other small i'm gonna give it to a small character real quick my other small character that probably didn't get a lot of attention um was sir darkling well, my best, Lord Darkling. Shout out Sir Darkling to the King's Guard member. He was a very loyal knight and wanted revenge for his father and wanted to serve Rhaenyra loyally. Um, but yes, shout out to his father. He had to be one of my favorite small roles of this season because the line that he told Sir Christian. It's one of the lines I even written down, so I won't forget it. He told Sir Christian, Is there no honor left in this world, Cole? Sacking your queen's castles, putting the people to the sword. King maker. Ugh. You are not fit to wear the white cloak. And that really meant a lot to me because in the books, Fire and Blood, everybody... Looks at Christian like he started this war. Everybody looked at Christian like a king maker. His name is King Maker in the books. Um, if you call him Sir Christian, you are probably on his side 
anybody else that is against a Christian during this war most likely called him cane making. And that's probably the one example we got this season. Is somebody finally confronting him, telling him off, and telling him, this is wrong what you're doing. I can't believe it. Is there any honor left? So, yeah, shout out to Lord Darkland and for giving that good quote in line. I'm trying to think of anything. It was Damon stuff at Heron Hall. I know a lot of people disliked it, but I read the books, so I'm a big magic fan when it comes to this universe, and we get a lot of it. I'm not going to be mad because in the Song of Ice and Fire universe, it's no like consistent magic. You can't just seek out magic on your own when you want to type things. It's not like uh instructions to this magic so when you get it it's like a rare event and we got a lot of it this season so i am very happy with it we've seen wellwood dreams we've seen dragon dreams we've seen green men we've seen a warging alice rivers so all the kooky magic stuff i just love i just love damon tripping balls at hair and hall <laughs> <laughs> but other than that I'm trying to see yes I, I really like Damon's character development this season too I'm a big Damon fan in the books and in the show it's fantasy people just find the people that you like and just deal with their dumb decisions as they do it Damon has did a lot of I'm going to say dumb decisions I would say mistakes in the beginning of the season Hiring two cheap assassins, uh, acting like he had nothing to do with it when he was arguing with his wife. Um, I feel like if he would have just took responsibility of his whole actions, Rhaenyra most likely would have forgave him. Because I really think Rhaenyra know what type of guy Damon is. She knew the type of drama and the type of violence that he would bring being around him not the violence that he provokes on her but the violence like assassinating people and killing people with all willy-nilly and taking off heads and things like that she knew she signed up for that and when he commits a few war crimes that's damon that's the man you married um when he came to court and said he nailed two thousand <laughs> of the crowd feeders men to a stake that's a war crime right now. You're not really supposed to do nothing after that. <laughs> Once you won the battle. Like. <laughs> kind of knew the guy you was messing with. Um, Trying to see if I didn't touch on anybody else. Eamon. Just give me more evil Eamon in season 3. I really don't want to know this guy's emotion. It seems like everybody in this show. It's kind of a gray character. You see sympathy from them. You see their emotional side. It kind of wasn't like that in Game of Thrones. You had some very evil characters. Very evil type characters. No gray in them. And this show it has a lot of gray characters. I wish there was. I hope they can just keep aiming as the solo evil man. There's no change in him. He wants to burn everything alive. So, <laughs> just, I just hope they just keep him as a bad anime villain. <laughs> because he's so cool. And show off that sapphire in his eye. Like, did we see it one time this season? I think we didn't see that sapphire in his eye one time. Maybe when he was in that brothel when he walked out. But I think he had his eye patch on. So, yes. I would love to see more of that sapphire in his eye. Um, we only seen it once. <laughs> but, yeah. Um, I can't wait for season three. Let me know down in the comments what were some of y'all favorite episodes and characters this season. Can't wait for season three. Hopefully... It's way more tragic events and battles. Um, only reason I clamor for more battles because it's book accurate that it's a lot of battles. Because in the book Fire and Blood, there was a lot of battles. Yes, some are 
main characters in this series are not in a lot of those battles, but a lot of those battles are important are important to the plot line. So yes, I just hope season three we can get at least four or five at least three or four battles. Three or four battles next season. Um but other than that it was an amazing season overall. I love the dialogue of this season. Only thing I probably didn't like was the Rhaenyra and Allison linking up all willy nilly out of nowhere. That's just that was just so phony and fake in a fantasy series. It's dragons here, and that was the fakest thing I I seen this season. So hopefully it won't be no sneaky link ups in the next season of House of the Dragon. It will be mostly important dialogue to these wars and setting up plot line and things like that. I want to I don't want to get into a lot of that cuz it will involve spoilers, but other than that, let's go on here <laughs> and jump into this reaction. I probably will split some of this up so y'all won't be watching 21 minutes of me rambling on about House of the Dragon season 2 before y'all jump into the reaction. But Let's jump into it. <laughs> oh, new intro? Same song, new intro, I see. This shit is beautiful. Like all the threads connected together, intertwined, and everybody is catching each other, and it's starting off good. <laughs> mm. Is that Magor? It eclipses all things. Even blood. All men of honor must pay its price. <laughs> oh shit, we back north, baby. The north must stand ready. Winter is coming. Coming. Ooh, I missed that thing. What is this that falls from the skies, ship? You at least had the mercy not to threaten me with your dragon. <laughs> so yeah, that person didn't uh, didn't work out that well. Came back lords instead of kings. In winter, my duty to the wall is even more dire than the one I owe to King's Landing. Ah, oh, yes, a bad hard start. Here. If my mother is to defend her claim, to hold the realm united, she needs an army. War is coming. I need a big one. To the whole of the realm, my lord. Alright, Dan, almost see all the to land. She's always winning. And Queen Alessand to see the wall. His grace stood at this very outlook. And watched as their dragons, the greatest power in the world, refused to cross it. Do you think my ancestors built a 700 foot wall of ice to keep out snow and savages? <laughs> what does it keep out? And goddamn white wobbles, yeah. boy. <laughs> the emo is hell. <laughs> I have thousands of grey beards who have already seen too many winters. Them old they are fools. Well, if your grey beards can fight, the queen will have them. They will fight hard, mm -hmm. like northerners. Some bloody shields and some bloody swords, goddammit. Urgent news from Dragonstone. Oh no, he's gonna find out about his brother. Yeah, it's time to go home. His brother got eight out the sky. <laughs> Cyrax? Oh no, that's Melee's. Take your mount again. We're flying out. <laughs> they even say we on a mother... Melis must gorge and rest. As must I. We're going to kill you. Said, to no, you roll and slow you roll. I cannot face that hoary old bitch alone. <laughs> With my dragon and yours together, we can kill Vagar and her rider. Was this the Queen's command? The Queen remains absent. We we'll talk about, about that later, right? Knees, but I must. She was a fool to go alone. What if Aemon were to happen upon her? Then I would pity Aemon. <laughs> Man, he's just if worried about his goddamn wife. Egon's line would be extinguished. <laughs> That's the truth. Could be alive. You'll still have a grandson. Fly with me. It is a command. What that you were the king. I don't respect this goddamn authority. Oh no! Out here going through it. Out there trying to find chunks for her little baby boy. My 
Sea snake, nope. It's a marvel she was able to return from the Stepstones at all. I must have my ship back at sea. To leave the Hey, I am all speed. The Smithy delivered this earlier. That loops bad? I had this commission for Prince Lucerus. Ah, oh, damn. They tell me that you're the one that dragged my body out of the sea. That's a loyal mother driver right there. I am indebted to you, Alan. If you know, you know. <laughs> Dragon pit. Hit aiming ass coming back home. Dragon! On the scorpion! God. I'll be shitting my pants right now. That's big guy old ass. <laughs> Come on, Granny. Get your ass in bed. Stun down! Now you're cutting the fuck up in the streets. Where is your Harris? Hmm? Attending his lessons. Taking him to the small council. He'll be king one day. He must begin his instruction. But if he doesn't. He's trying, he's trying his father. I'll give it to him. I'm afraid. Not the dragons. The rats. No, 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 no. Please, please. I hope this prophecy the queen will not be true. God, way. no. You must always listen. What the <sighs> fuck? Who in that <laughs> I'll give him some of that Sir Christian, huh? Two of the biggest player haters in Westeros. You gotta put on 17 pieces of arm just to fuck. You gotta be horny, little <laughs> motherfucker. <laughs> Oiling your goddamn float. No, no, no. They don't even know what's right on that. They goddamn know. Our letters to the Vale and to the North continue to go unanswered. Is that you solving it? Okay. Should be ours after Prince Aemon's marriage pact. He said, "Put my ball down." It's mine. I anticipate. Touch my ball. But we. Thank you, my prince. <laughs> he is acting funny. My nephew. Between that and their blockade of the gullet, we must presume that the princess has refused the offered terms, and that war is now inevitable. Yeah. What the? Perhaps my friend is forced to our negotiated. Release it at once. Would someone please is he's having a hard time bothering you, Thailand? No, 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 not even. No, never. I think he wants a ride. He's an angel. Wouldn't that be fun, Jaharis? Should the Master of Coin be your royal steed? <laughs> oh no, we're just joking, right? We we joshing, right? We're not. We joshing. Very well. No time for amusements, Thailand. <laughs> you lucky bastard. We have need for a new master of ships. We could offer the title to the young Lord Dalton Gray. Oh, uh, you god what is your damn business here? Bastard. The king summoned me. You do not. And, and we can burn the blockade while we're at it. Rhaenyra has dragons as well. Mine are bigger. If we loose the dragons <coughs> to war, there'll be no calling them back. And Vagar is needed here to deter Rhaenyra from attacking in retribution for the death of her son. Errors were made. Oh, you got in the a smile on your face. So favor patience and restraint. I send ravens by the hour, many and more. Like, right, boy, 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 when we gonna start swinging swords? History of Ah, uh, this look creepy. <laughs> I have come over here to have a word before the small council convened, but your handmaiden said that you were indisposed. They no longer breathe our air. I've chosen your new stuff. What did y'all expect? Y'all have to mend war crimes before the war even start. <laughs> Alright. Please don't be the bad body. Who is this poor bastard that's gonna burn alive? Dragon! You better run, goddammit. You don't need one bodyguard, short. <laughs> that's a badass drag. <laughs> Sorry, I said, I wish one of you mother would touch me. 
Oh no, is it him? About this cloak. Oh, oh no! Both of them. Aegon right, the Magnanimous. The Magnanimous. <laughs> nigga, what? King of the Andals and the Royal Lord King of the, the whole ass niggas. And protector of the realm. Hey, Ooh, King you got now, so I'll sound it. Tis my flock. A, a, a tenth of them taken by the crown on, on the cusp of winter. And we should return them. Your Grace? You gotta you stay face in front of the people, back. man. You playing this shit good? Sheep, even better. I don't pull the f out. Make your flock of sheep. I'd, perhaps we could just return his sheep. He came all this way. If you return one herd of sheep, your grace, you'll you find at the foot of your throne expecting the same. Now the ones at Aegon trying to do something right. When? Hugh, your grace. Hugh the hammer. <laughs> Iron costs have grown. A lone scorpion takes weeks to build. To put it simply, we are struggling. It's king, you gotta you look out for me And paid well. My army cannot win a war without your weapons. You should continue their making. Our victory oh, no, you depends on the efforts of the small girl. folk. The next petition. Okay, we doing one for one, goddammit. Damn, let somebody get some more paper around here, nigga. You controlled your father the same way. Reputation oh, he already pliable. stirring up the mother pie, nigga. Of he might be the main the chef in the kitchen. The <laughs> he might be cooking. Would wish to be viewed <laughs> differently. Yeah, but you must accept that the path to victory now is one of violence. War gotta be fought, man. It, but that does not mean it must be wanton. Yeah, no. that's understandable. That's an understandable shit right there. I don't want to assemble 20,000 men to die and burn to goddamn death, but goddamn it, sometimes I have to. How <laughs> long have you been selling secrets to Otto Hightower? As long as he had gold to pay for them. Then you mother goddamn it. You said you flee. You gonna back down me like this? this <laughs> you could have gone on the throne. That my arrangement with the hand was purely transactional. I held no loyalty to him. There's nothing of value to you, Damon. This pimp Damon, bitch. Your mind, body, and soul belong to me. Have her moved to the cells. She is to be treated as a traitor to the crown. Oh my god. Holy Forget fuck. Prince. I reckon I were names of the King's Guard are just eight and ten. And we swore the same oath to defend the whole of the royal family. So what were we to do when they turn against one another? He's telling the truth, folks. <laughs> You lucky my mother wife came home, nigga. I would have slapped the shit out your whole ass. I'm dragon mount. Did you find what you needed? They're good. Time to go to work now. I will fly to Harren Hall at your command and set our toehold in the Riverlands. Come on, lock in right now, please, lock in. I want Aemond Targaryen. One command. Y'all motherfuckers got one goddamn command. Y'all better not f*** up. I don't care what y'all got to do to get the nigga. Get him. <laughs> yeah, like a nigga that wants something. <laughs> you, Grace? Mom. <laughs> Mama. Lady Jane Aaron. Mammy. Has pledged her support. In exchange for a dragon to guard the veil. Ah, damn, we and missed that high action. Lord has promised 2,000 men. Play with your chest, man. I know it's rough on you, boy. You know, lost your brother, man. God damn. Pain, only they know right now. Byron went for the mother. Flying to the sky, the fathers. Oh, I see, bro. Damn, she ain't lost the love of her goddamn life. One last goodbye for your baby boy. Lucerus and Lauren. Oh, I see. 
please, please, please don't let this happen. For the love of God. That's madness. We ain't gotta do this, no. Anger flea bottom is back, mother. Yeah. Come on, bro. Never gone for long. I'm told you'd bear a mislike for the high towers. The high towers. <laughs> what type of treacherous shit gonna go down? We know what's gonna go down, you read the book. <laughs> Michael's tunnels. What type of rat's nest it is. One thing the mother is going is to be your friend. Ass ass. <laughs> to find and slay the Prince Aemon Targaryen. He has silver hair and one eye. Should be easy enough to find. What if we can't find him? Precious days in this war of quills and raven. No. Words, grandsire and mother. Y'all can play one game. War of oh, y'all want to, but it's some dark shit going to go down. Well. And they must see them. She blames me for starting this war. After she plotted with my father's counsel to usurp his throne. I mean, you did kill a nigga. And Rhaenyra is a cunning spider. Long ago, she drew Alison into her web. Oh my god. Intoxicated. Get off her dick, nigga. How would you say, um, blood and <laughs> Oh my god, no. I can set him and his dragon on my foes at will. Keep your eyes down. Hey, this drunk talking shit, just yapping. No one even know what's gonna happen. Yes, yes, the untamable beast. These are some man. It's hard to love them. I thought the rest was your bit. God damn, y'all turning on each other already? You right here. Take the rest of the gold yourself. You money hungry bastards. Oh, you are dick. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, y'all some assholes. This way. Pick a dog like that. You are not doing your job, sir. You don't see that big ass rat right there. No, no, no. Oh, yeah. I'm not supposed to be up here. Did you not hear the prince? You didn't came this far, mother. No gold. Stay still. <laughs> Who the f you got? <laughs> oh no, no, no. A son for a son, he said. But does she look like a f son to you? <laughs> These niggas are oh, mad. We got a madman in the crew. We need to get our head and get out. <laughs> Oh no, you ain't have to do this. Which? This is the hardest question. I have ever. a necklace. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Smart, Helena. It's of great value. Come on, I know you motherfuckers like gold. That's no son. <laughs> it's the other one. She's not gonna give up the king's hair that easy. No. She's telling true. Hold him down. What the? F what the? F oh no 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 no! God no! For the love of God! What the f man? Run, Helena! Run, Helena! Run! What the f are you right now? You, you, you motherfuckers ain't he worth shit. Oh my god. Oh, you motherfuckers worthless. What are the guards that everybody just around drinking? R.I.P. Right, Harris. Rust oh my god. This is the aftermath. Gotta round them up. Gotta round them up. Who killed my goddamn son? Oh, them hounds. Come on, doggy. Find them, doggy. Good boy.
Oh my god! Oh, I'm down, Aegon! Drake is in village! The man just lost his son, let him get that anger out, man! God damn! Damon, you took it too far! Damon, this is your fault. If you would have killed Lucerius, all this wouldn't have happened. Damon wouldn't have went this far. Damon would have looked would have committed a little bit of murder, not this huge murder. <laughs> the gates have been shut. The search progresses. The they came through the walls, found. not the gates. We mustn't be shaken by this. My grandson just got killed. But what have you done to, to, to my girl? <laughs> oh my. Seven hells. I want to cry with at this point, man. I don't know kids desire that. Let's be for real. I'd wear with the members of this council while the murderer threatened their king. Were you also threatened to agree? I could have been! Jason! I mean, Thailand, my shut son up! My is my legacy! My son is heir to the Iron Throne! What? Where were you? The Lord Commander of my King's Guard. Mm -hmm. Now we ask some serious questions. This is not the time for blind accusations. It is the time! You know who did this soon enough. Who, who will do this save the bitch queen of bastards? Oh, Smug that is your sister! There she sits across the bay on her rock laughing at me. She's laughing at me! This is an understandable temper tantrum. <laughs> the guard has detained someone. The man we apprehended is known to us. It's a gold cloak. Noted for his brutal They call blood? We caught him, fleeing the gate of the gods, with the child's head in a sack. Oh my. I'll kill him myself. These are some we ruthless. Well what information we can from the blackguard. Could be anyone. It could be any one of you in this room. Except Allison and Otto. Let's <laughs> say <their> grandkid. <laughs> but this game of thrones. <laughs> I will not be seen as... Weak. You're already seen as weak. Oh Egon. my. You better watch your tone, nigga. <laughs> oh wow, how tough. So you would name her Monster Slayer of Infants. Yep. I saw some propaganda. A funeral progress. Let them see the child. No. I will not have my little son's body. Dragged through the street like a dead dog. Not dragged, Still a good father at the end of the day. Escorted to the dragon pit to be burned as a Targaryen prince. Give him a minute. This just happened. Those who declared for Rhaenyra, will they still support her when they hear of her depravity? Or will they rather not renounce her? Jaehaerys will do more for us now than a thousand knights in battle. Oh my, he is. I gotta give it to Otto. He is a genius. <laughs> Ah, oh, poor Helena. I feel so sorry for her. her son. She lost her son. Helena, what you saw last night when you came to my room? This is for my boy. You don't care about that. God. I'm thinking about yourself all the time. Are you banging some questions? Great. You want a cookie? Bala Mabu. We're gonna miss you bullying them Lannisters. What happened to Cheese? Did Cheese get away? Oh, he no, finna get me. Oh, you spoke that fast? He put a rat catcher. Employed by the household. I don't, I don't know, know his right, right name. He didn't have to throw a tool at him. He just started snitching and he whipped it out. <laughs> Oh, they sold the head. Oh my, it's so dark. Oh no. What the hell? You're gonna hurt me. Yep, you're gonna get hurt real bad, buddy. You're gonna feel come some pain. This, Grace. The devil hasn't even felt. <laughs> you're gonna feel the rage of a father, a grieving father. You got him a mace? Mm-hmm. Do him dirty, Aegon. 
Uh, we in flea bottom now? <laughs> I hope we in flea bottom. Yeah, they dirty. We in flea bottom, baby. <laughs> I look like zombies. Get the bag. <laughs> Oh, that body better not fall, please. There go my coin. It is yet unclear how the keep itself was breached. And they are accusing me of having a hand in this. It appears so. There have been messages sent to that effect. We know who did this. Right now, you know who did it. We send our own messages. Rainy's looking at them right now. I'm not sure they will be responsible. But it's a lie. Damon's sitting there smiling. <laughs> what a bastard. On Helena of all people. An innocent. Her sweet sister did not deserve that. The death of Prince Lucerus. <laughs> it's really just sitting there gloating. <laughs> you got an aura around it. Secret merely thought. Perhaps an action taken in haste. Mind yourself. Before you get pimp slapped. You see how I'm looking at his ass. He's like, I will beat the dog shit out of you. <laughs> the boy lies dead and I am accused of killing him. Sorry, provided me with names and a subterfuge. I was clear in my instructions. Where are you, Damon? Brother of Egg on the Usurper. I cannot be responsible. Cannot you know you're getting old now. You made sure. <laughs> so I said, no. I don't believe you. I believe him. He's a trustful, honest guy. I cannot trust you, Damon. What? I've never trusted you wholly. Much that I wished to, willed myself to. You say you needed me. <laughs> but now I have. I have served you faithfully. Have you? Or have you used me? As a tool with which to grasp at your stolen inheritance. <laughs> what you just say, bitch? <laughs> you gonna clown me out like that? I've been skipped over generation after generation. <laughs> it might turn into some sex. So hold on. <laughs> oh shit. Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> when Sir Eric brought you the crown, did I myself not place it upon your brow? Yes, but afterward, when I thought it meant to consider the terms of the folly for us to give up my brother's throne to the traitorous lies of my throne, Damon, mine. You think me some kind of monster? Oh, I don't know what to think of you. I don't know what you are or who it is you serve. Am I not on my way even now to Arunal to raise an army in your name, Rhaenyra? Yours. I want to do for you. You think killing kids is easy? Do you accept me? As your queen and ruler. How many times I got to bend the knee? Your father was a coward who knew I was the stronger son, that I was the leader of men, and he was afraid to be seen in my shadow. Oh, now the truth come out. How dare you? Or did he merely use you as a tool to put me in my place because he was afraid of me? Because he knew your legacy, unlike mine, would never outshine his own. He was not afraid of you. truth is hard sometimes. He could not trust you. Who sought greatness but shrank from spilling blood to achieve it, and I see you will suffer the same fate. You struck down a child. You gotta do what you gotta do, sir. Stake. You're pathetic. A first argument. Second, I think. <laughs> he is gonna go cheat or kill somebody. <laughs> Father. And stop, you better get your daddy some space right now. When morning comes, take Moon Dancer and keep a watch on King's Landing. I must know which course they take next. Day high. Bella, badass, she got this. My father? He must follow his own path. Your father is a cold hearted bastard. <laughs> the, the blood worm. Ready for. Battle. That's a seasoned veteran right there, baby. Both up the rider and the dragon. Riverlands, here we come. What is this? Been in flea bottom, huh? It's a reminder of yesterday, I think. The procession was muddy. I'll replace it, Hans. Do it now. The night was long, Sir Kristen. 
No, I'd like you to. If I could you just defy find... my authority, Sir Eric. Why are you tweaking? The white cloak is a symbol of our purity, our fidelity. King's Guard are a sacred trust. Now we know your cloak we ain't white no more. Sully. Where were you when Jaharis was murdered? Where were you? And a traitor to the crown. They say, I ain't got nothing to do with this. I'm gone. <laughs> and then the young prince is murdered on your watch. You are mad, sir. Mad? You do not think what I think has no relevance. You have brought disgrace upon our ranks. He is such a dick this I season, man. Restore it. He got crazy ass. Look at him. <laughs> you will go to Dragonstone and strike down Rhaenyra in her own halls. The way she sought to do with Aemond. This who sent him? Back in her own oh coin. my god. Begins. You sending the King's Guard to be a petty assassin. Come on, man. Capable of the duties, but come, like, come on. You would send me to my death. What a triumph. What type of honor is that? What type of glory will you give Almost me in a I queen slayer? The... I hate him, I hate him, I hate him. Let him win a war showing up. I wasn't hungry. No I beautiful baby. Really. And sing sailor's shanties. Yeah, Bought him up right. Don't. Taught him how to live off the land and how to have fun. Uh, two yeah, important five things in this time. Ooh, we got a shield maiden dance going on, a little sassy boy. Pop my cloak for this one. <laughs> you know this sad boy stuff? On this emo stuff? And he considers me such a foe. And that he seeks to murder me in my bed. He's afraid of me. You just want to be acknowledged by your uncle, man. By the big home. The boy is going to regret that business with Luke. I lost my temper that day. I am sorry for it. I mean, like they got lost her temper. They be playing around different. with an old woman like that. She don't know what playing is at that age. Much the same. You the hammer. They living in the trenches. I see all your great adventures have done nothing for your looks. <laughs> well met, brother. After many months away. Or Alan. I've broken my teeth on hard tack, Adam. Mm. Say you have a pot of your goat stew simmering at home. You were in luck. In more ways Sound than one. Sound good than a mop. If he can take Harren Hall, all may well be forgiven. In the meantime, oh, you going for Harren Hall right now? Okay, okay. Will we get it this episode? Find out. We got about 30 more minutes left. Back. Queen Fulton. <laughs> The history of dragons. From Danny used to dream all the way to Aegon the Conqueror. Your grace. Maybe even had some history on the ancestors of Valyria. Who are you? A prisoner. I am Damon's whore. <laughs> he said it was the price of my freedom. Does he say otherwise? He's gone. Damon don't give a fuck. Did you? How long have you been oh, dealing with Damon? Oh, 20 oh, years. I do not know. Now it seems he's done it again, made a promise, and then... Fucked off. <laughs> y'all have dealing with Damon Targaryen, the role prince. What do y'all expect when y'all start dealing with this nigga? <laughs> what dragon is that? Do you smoke? Maybe off the white? There's all the rat catchers. Do they even get cheese? They got them. Oh, That's sad. That's the only sad part about it. That dog will end up in a... <laughs> <laughs> in a pot of brown tonight. <laughs> the rat catchers! Oh, I had them hanged. 
the maggot who took my son confessed to an accomplice. Yeah, he'd be a good one, um, yeah. <laughs> for certain, but... Idiot! Beware how you speak to your king, my lord. The king is my grandson, and my grandson is a fool. He's worse yeah. than a fool. He's murdered innocent men. They are fathers and brothers and sons. And their wives and children gather now at our gates to weep and curse your name. Tell them the truth. Somebody got to tell that Edward Cole the truth. I wish to spill blood, not ink. Sir Kristen Cole has acted. Ah, uh, she can lose his damn and job. What has Sir Kristen Cole done? He has sent Sir Eric to slay Rhaenyra. You idiot. You idiot. All y'all are idiots. Hello. I'm just now realizing I don't miss the glue. <laughs> He's pretending he is to be holding in this shit yeah. show together. <laughs> God's help us all. And you acceded to this this prank without consulting <laughs> or the, the prank. council. You never think of your father. His forbearance, his judiciousness, his dignity. Dignity. Oh my God! I want revenge. My father is dead. He is, and we are the poorer for it. This is y'all put on the throne. What did y'all expect? <laughs> he was right about you. Wait, what? What did he say? He made me king. <laughs> if you believe that, you still fool. Is that God. what you think? Remove your badge. Sir Otto. Wow, it's really happening in this episode. <laughs> he is the only one that speaks with sense and caution. <laughs> we gonna miss you, boy. Insolent pup. They was up there in the old town, folks. You think yourself clever, but without a strong hand at your side. Give it to Cole. You giving the hand of the cane to this thug. He is My nothing but a thug. You will regret this. He will. Give it to him. You giving it to a guy who crash out first and ask questions later. Like, come on now. You are dismissed. You said if you wasn't my daughter's son, I would beat her. <laughs> She's like, hold on. I just seen you, Sir Eric. Why is Sir Eric here? <laughs> we getting it this we getting a lot this episode. <laughs> you are so treacherous. You Sir are Eric. nothing like your honorable brother. Me and Lou's honor doing war, man. How low can you go? Like, come on, man. You finna see how low and how dark and how gruesome men can get when wartime. And you are forced to pick a side. <laughs> are you playing around right now? <laughs> but Eric, why don't you just cut your ponytails or you join the other side? You Shave your beard or something. So Eric. You treacherous bastard. Believe me. Brother! Do not do this. Come on, don't do this. It's y'all brother. Y'all brothers, man. Sake. Wait in there, swing and steal. Come on, defend your queen. Oh, just cut him down. You bastard! Come on, slay your brother. Your grace! Salara! With me, your grace! Come on, protect the protect Which is Eric? You can't tell right now. You just gotta let something happen. I can't tell either. I got lost in the scuffle. 
We were born together. You bastard! But I still love you, brother. Oh! Y'all are brothers. Twins. You're great. Eric. Forgive me. No, 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 don't fall on your sword. I'll return to Old Town. The High Towers still have strength, and you have a son there. Daron? Kindly to instruction. Daron may yet help us in weeks to come. Where's Aegon? Damn. We love this son, man. <laughs> Like I gotta say, you gotta forgive some of the stuff he did this episode. He is grieving. <laughs> this a new type of kink? Okay. <laughs> this is how y'all get down, I guess. <laughs> the thing, hot and wet. <laughs> it started with a guy. Did this weak ass son, a then Nagor, the crew was stirred. Then along came Jerry, so that was saying. Damon finna be back on this bullshit. It's wartime. Looks riverlandish. Must be my soul. You can get that thing up. Well enough for killing Blackwoods. <laughs> oh my god, some Blackwood and Bracket B. Cracking cows can fill their belly. That was the test. <laughs> fuck, fuck you. This is our land. What do you mean? What y'all gonna do about it? It's Bracken land. What did you say? Your false queen, Rhaenyra, is a kinslayer. Aegon Targaryen is no true king. You're both craven. I already know it's not. I'm on black woods. I die. What do you mean? You don't do it with that little sword. Come on, swing it. You're mad. Swing it. You go up and swing it. <laughs> you wouldn't dare. You ain't got the heart, you coward. <laughs> oh, just after the battle of the burning mill. Oh my. Oh, I wish they could have showed this battle. This battle was so just bloody and just unnecessary. <laughs> oh, it's this corpse. Bodies on bodies. R.I.P. R.I.P. The twins. Sir Eddie and Sir Eddie. What of those who sent him? Like, come on, mommy. You got your little revenge, nah? Soon they will not even remember what it was that began the war in the first place. Or was it when the child was beheaded? Or when Aemon killed Luke? Or when Luke took Aemon's eye? We teeter now at the point where none of it will matter. Just a cycle of violence. They died because of you, whole Christian. They ain't no sir no more, you whole Christian. Oh, they didn't raise the green banners with the golden, most beautiful dragon of the world, Sunfire the Golden. Kingsguard, what? What? How? How did y'all become Kingsguard? Y'all sitting on y'all ass. Y'all are Kingsguard. What are y'all guarding? Y'all sitting on your ass. Perhaps, Your Grace, but we cannot all hide in our castles waiting for war to come to us. As now it surely will. As now. Oh, they finna go out on campaign, baby. <laughs> House Brad. The Blackwoods and the Brackens have feuded for centuries. This is nothing more than an excuse for them to indulge their ancient grudge. It's not Basically, true. this ain't nothing but an excuse for them to get down. Call it what Lord Grover Tully is a flaccid old fool who can control his curly. 
<laughs> Do you have any better suggestions, Lord Jasper? Coming from you, all right? Marches from Should we not aim to unite these armies and then strike <laughs> as one? Ah, oh, the great military mind of the Citadel. Do I remind me which link in your chain denotes the art of war. She said, I was saying that it's able with idiots. Harren Hall is the key to the Riverland. The Riverlands will be the last place on the world of that universe I would want to live. Anytime somebody want to do a war, y'all come bring that shit to the Riverlands. Take that to y'all own home. I'm as fearsome as any of them. Yeah, sure. Whatever you say, eh, girl? Raina. Your grace. I've decided to send Joffrey. This ain't Raina in the men. That's ain't Raina's funeral. Lady Jane Aaron. She... Egon and Viserys will accompany him until a place of greater safety can be found. Taraxes is but a hatchling. And Stormcloud. I want you to go with them. You must take the little ones further. To Pentos, I think. When my mother died. It is safer than anywhere in Westeros. I'm sorry to put this upon you. It breaks my heart to send my boys away. Raina. I need you to be the mother to them that I cannot. Oh, that's a lot to ask for. Them, train them. And my sister. I need Bailey here. Because she has a dragon. I cannot promise to make you happy. But I ask you, make, make this, this sacrifice willingly. For all of us. <sighs> you gotta feel worthless being in a family with a dragon riders and you not one. Even your daddy a dragon rider. Look at him on the rats. Mama was a dragon rider. Sister a dragon rider. Your new baby brother's dragon riders. Like I'm <laughs> Heron Hall. Oh, I know they sick of dragons. <laughs> they having flashbacks to Valerian they gone all over again. They wasn't even alive in that era. <laughs> First diamond has landed. Got dark sister out. He taking the castle solo. <laughs> this him the Karasis. This was probably gonna be a beautiful castle if Bagon never burnt it. <laughs> Heron Hall is spooky than a motherfucker. <laughs> Those how strong banners. Or another extinct house that lived here. <laughs> On the cheese and cues. Check your walkie, crash come in. You see anything? <laughs> How do you just attack? <laughs> Family dinner. Oh, this is gonna be messy. Gotta hear a dragon landing on y'all stuff. <laughs> gotta, gotta give it to him. You got some heart walking up on Damon right now. Are you benching me? Shan't let it waste. This guy's be the most nervous dinner ever. <laughs> I've survived for many of. Do you not think it's strange that his father. My nephew, Lord Lionel, perished by fire, and his son too, here in this damp place. It was the first fire here since Balerion ended the line of Harren the Black. Oh Even in my. Summer, we struggled to light the hearths. So, no, you will find no loyalty to Laris Strong here, my prince. Your Grace. Forgive me, I. I um... You better, you better watch your tongue. <laughs> your grace. Mm -hmm. Good now, sauce. That's how you, that's how you put that glaze on there. <laughs> what, not to be argumentative, in something of a state of disrepair, since your forebear incinerated much of it with his dragon. Well, that is precisely why we must bring it into a state of repair. <laughs> the there are 40,000 swords in the Riverlands, the largest undeclared host in the realm. Only Harrenhal is of a size enough to garrison them. Houses Bracken and Blackwood have long detested one another. Why? Oh, well, 
They're Brackens and Blackwoods, that's why. The answer to that is <laughs> lost in time. Sin this is the Crips and Bloods of Westeros. <laughs> sin, but as soon as you think it's peaceful, somebody just dropped the diss track. We march on King's Landing and take the throne. The throne? Yeah, what do you think we're fighting for? It's a big chair made of sword. <laughs> it's a squire. Lord Commander, your host is mustered and ready to march. He's gonna ride out. May I present my brother, Sir Gwen Hightower? Arrived last night from Altan. Sir Kristen. Mayhaps, I should say. My Lord Hand. <laughs> That's what he was looking at. <laughs> Your grace. Ah, oh, yeah, he's gonna murder. He's gonna murder about a thousand today. <laughs> going to war for that coachy. Yeah. yeah, that's what he deserves. That's the raven's feast on that corpse. We riding out the battle. The value of a sword is not within its scabbard. We will secure victory with armies, not with dragons alone. Randy's like, you better shut the fuck. Well, we you remain right. here as a source of distraction for the enemy. He proposed to conduct the war in my absence. It would merely be a precaution. It would be treason. They ready to burn everything down. Further. This council would do well to remember that their queen wears the crown of my grandsire, Jaehaerys the Conciliator, a prudent ruler, the wisest of Targaryen kings whose reign outlasted every other, even Aegon the Conqueror's. Oh no, Rainies. Did y'all forget y'all history? You gotta feel for the girl. Like, come on. <laughs> Be safe enough. Far away from any danger with only babes to nurse me. You do a great service. Ain't no sweet talking out of this. These eggs. Is this their final goodbye? We'll never know. Well, we will know. <laughs> I feel sad about Jaharis. But I ought not to, I think. As people die all the time. Grieve how you want to grieve, Elena. With a small folk. I, I forgive you. For what? Since you, no, she felt guilty for... Even so, Christian distracted doing that event. How did y'all get white clothes? What is going on? I was given the conqueror's name and his crown, so I shall wear his armor to war. That's a guy's armor. Sir Christian, plus I'm persuaded to fly to war with Sir Christian, so the Queen Alison may reign in his absence, with Prince Aemon at her side. He is such a snake. <laughs> Matters little. You looking at the man who's playing these lies. <laughs> what tempted to them then? You just give him the green light to torture somebody for no reason. My father always said he had no use for a master of whisperers. And yet, I find myself wanting for one. I should be glad of your talents. You honor me, your grace. Ah, uh, you moving on up. <laughs> I, I can't stand. Shall we escort you to the dragon pit, <laughs> your grace? I think mayhaps I shall fly another day. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's, that's, a, that's a good idea. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes. Come out with us, my king. He's never f***ed a woman. But you're sworn to chastity now. <laughs> <laughs> This is what happens when you get your best friends as your king guard. <laughs> Lee bottom. Off you mother. They finna get towed up. Off that oil. Who was your grandson? They call him the conciliator. King Jaharis. Shouldn't be telling Now who is your father? Balon? You are 
I'm the son of Balon the Bull. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. I just knew it on my top of my head. <laughs> the late king was saying, he speaks truth right enough. Look, you can tell by his hair. Yeah, because I'm their half brother. Yeah. All right. I'll tell you who else doesn't. Yes, I am a bastard. The right. Are you gone? All hail the king! All hail the king! Drinks for all! At the pleasure of the crown! Yes! You can't be out here on free bottom party with the king! Damn it, I the king free bottom. What the going on? Y'all yeah, wanna be like y'all uncle so bad. God, hey God! <laughs> Lord of the Seven Kingdoms. Oh, wow. I knew it. Nobody can keep him in check. Once Otto is gone, it's over with. He is off the leash. Oh. And, and, and yet you still lie with your very first. <laughs> what a fine. Oh, he, he gonna beat your ass, Aegon. You better shut up. Wait. Our company has come back yonder. Mm. On the cold, hard ground. Which is why we make for the bull. A tavern with an excellent reputation on the Rosby Road, not two miles away from memory serves. We, we will rendezvous with your army at first light. Or if their wine is good, perhaps a little after first light. He like, hold on, is that a dragon? We're exposed. What? Get to the trees! Yeah! Yeah! Who is that, Baylor? Oh shit, Jack. <laughs> Moon dancing. Baylor, you were just supposed to stay in the sky, Baylor. Y'all are all so hot headed. <laughs> She's gonna burn him alive. That's a fast dragon, too. It's like smaller. Set that tree line to blaze. I just started burning the trees. I don't care. <laughs> we'll plant some more in this wall over it. He is crying. He is crying. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, you know his pants for the doo-doo. Oh, she was ready to toast him. Some half dozen other nights, I'm sure of it. Perhaps a scout party for a greater army. The Ravens confirm it, Your Grace. Lord Farringer's reported a larger force Moving north okay, that makes sense. They just a scouting party. I don't know why the Lord Commander was going to scouting party though. Okay, <laughs> it was not so. Uh, you must act now, Your Grace. Loose the dragon's root coal out and burn him. <sighs> Is it gonna work? This is your decision right now. You're the queen. I have heard your arguments and will consider them. Okay, yeah, okay. Sleep on it. We're gonna need a real answer tomorrow, though. Who was that? Who was that? Yeah, it's time to grab Dark Sister. Crashes, where you at? <laughs> was it a guard here trying to be tough? You know, hair hall, no, oh, being very on. mysterious. And I have to clean up afterwards. Oh, my. Wait a minute. This is dark as fuck. What the? Is he about a werewolf? How did you end up there? You will die in this place. Who is you? <laughs> what do you know of the movements of Alicent Hightower? Would you take her hostage? Or kill her? I would speak with her. Myself. Killing her would be easier. If war Ooh. can be averted, it is my duty to avert it. Right now, uh, I have uh, maybe of the same opinion. What is, what is happening she right now? What is happening? You just need to mount up at this point. So I make my way to the Red Keep, I presume, and 
Ring the bell. Or do I scale the wall and enter her window? There is one. How are you taking this risk? <laughs> Outside. You got Damon's cloak. At least get Damon's cloak. <laughs> that cloak is like a hundred percent power. Like you can go anywhere. That's like that um Lord of the Rings uh, cloak. You come invisible, just blend in with where you at. Nah, that ain't Damon's cloak. From the Kings going with it. So Stephanie. Hope you got it on him. Got the great set right now? Yeah, the great set. Okay. Hopefully these the new guys and they don't know one of their brothers. Former brothers. <laughs> Talking about the Kings guard, there he is. You got something on him. Good shit. Like she's seen a ghost. Your knights would find me. I would be taken or slain. Do not before I killed you. Yeah, what type of plan was this? <laughs> before all gathered in that room that you would make a fine queen. Do you think me capable of such naked deceit? <laughs> Coming here is just so unnecessary. He said he was the prince that was promised to unite the realm. What? I desire peace as you do, but to possess. Did my father use those words? The prince that was promised. Yes, he did. Okay, now this is interesting. <laughs> Maybe y'all get to the bottom of this. Spoke to you of the song of ice and fire. We said the what now? <laughs> About Egon the Conqueror. The, the Conqueror. Yeah, you see how you made that big mistake. Listen to a dying man on his deathbed that have been heavily medicated. <laughs> you must go before you are discovered. There's been a mistake. There's been no mistake. Please. <sighs> you can prevent this, Alison. There's a been No mistake. My father has gone from court. Court is on the march, Eamon. You know what Eamon is? So I can't stop him at this point. There was no point in coming here. Oh, this is so risky and pointless. <laughs> Who is this, Prince Diamond? How the fuck is he landing? I can't hear it. What's she saying? Oh wow, he is so in love with Young Ray Nero. <laughs> Speak plainly. Another Heron Hall journey. I guess that's a way to end the dream. There's been a raven. Oh my. What the hell? What's wrong with his hand? Even if you can raise a host of rivermen, it will not be ready in time to face him. Aaron Hall is a shithole. <laughs> Let's see what your Lord Paramount is made of. Gonna go see the Muppets? Lord Grover is looking more hale and healthy than I expected. Uh, this is Sir Oscar Tully, grandson to Grover Tully. He is <laughs> River Run and the future Lord Paramount of the Riverlands. This is a boy. This is a child. How fares your grandsire? So he's alive. Yeah. Yes. Gods be good. Well, my time is short and I have need of an army. Perhaps you might place a feather pillow over his head and speed along your inheritance. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I how dark, Damon. Like Lord Grover raised me in his stead. Damon, you are a monster. I speak with your grandsire's voice for House Tully in the Riverlands. While he still lives? Duh. That is not our way. I can see why the Blackwoods and the Brackens did not fear to start a war beneath the nose of their liege lords. You got another boy. And you are Alan. Yes. I'm you so said so. you look mighty familiar, nigga. <laughs> I'm given to understand my lord husband owes you his life. But I was not told his savior was so comely. Your mother must have been very beautiful. 
<laughs> he was the sailor who plucked you from your watery grave. Yes. You did not think to mention it. I did not think it relevant. I know who he is, Corliss. She ain't dumb, boy. Alan's past is that a dragon in the face. background? Saved his lord's life. He should be raised up and honored, not hidden beneath the tides. Is it you should have burned them when you had the chance. Perhaps you can, Sir Alfred, when you next sight them on your dragon. <laughs> Y'all need to just go out there and go to war. Everybody is going to be on here turning on each other, just using all this hate and turning against each other. No, we fighting a war with each other. That we need to raise alliances and command our vassals, but they are gone. What has come of this council? Ah, oh, that's the man we need back right here. My lord. Oh, what battle is this? Men of House Darkland! All who bend the knee to the true king, Aegon, will be spared. You can One of Rhaenyra's king's guards is Darkling, the uh, guy that escorted her into the city. This is basically his family. Is there no honor left in this world, Cole? Sacking your queen's own castles and putting up people to the sword. Kingmaker. <laughs> oh, you, you. <laughs> I like him. Not fit for the white cloak. Tell him the truth. I'm gonna die in your way. This is a. Yours will come in kind. Mm hmm. Oh! <laughs> Treacherous bastard. He ain't nothing but a thug. They gave a th they gave a thug a white cloak and a hand. This war will not be won with dragons alone, but with dragons flying. They so need some soldiers on the field, shorty. No, Cole is already preparing his attack. Uh, how how do you know this? He sent word to me. They don't be telling him nothing. Oh my. This is real person. We speak in Valyrian. <laughs> Just taunting him. So come on, do sign, do sign. Luke Coston vividus segiton vilivasni. That wasn't fluent, was it? Paranoid is a use. I would leave this place immediately. <laughs> it's too spooky here. Look like Dracula's home. There it go again. What? Is that a real person this time? Behind you, Prince Damon. Is he following himself? What is going on? This is so spooky. <laughs> he in here tripping balls. Huh? What the f <laughs> It's a touch late to be stalking about a strange castle putting its people to the sword. You. I'm called Alice. What type of creepy stuff are Rivers. you up to? You bastard. Harren Hall's been cursed since its first stone was laid. Black Haddon fell the grove of weirwood trees that grew on these lands. Heart trees imbued with the spirits of those who lived long before he came. Oh, we're getting some good lore. The whispers can still hear bed you sleep in was made from such a heart tree. You experienced anything of note? You are a strange kind of woman. Even the beers make it. I'm no woman at all. Here, drink this. Nah, I'm not drinking that. <laughs> Damon, don't drink that. To win this place to your Damon. Oh, he up in there tripping balls now. Treachery against the laws of God's and men. And against the crown. How did he get <laughs> Who are you? Sir William Blackwood of House Blackwood, your grace. As I said, I once vied for Queen Rhaenyra's hand. That was you? I always liked her spirit. 
She had the true blood of the dragon. Lena? My boy Damon on some psychedelics today. <laughs> In the hope that you might be half the king your father was. Tread carefully. Or what? That's your mama. What's gonna do, boy? Catches. A damp day. Maybe, um, kind of wet. Maybe it rained the night before. Maybe drag fire won't hurt that much. <laughs> Making batter around. Maybe some siege ladders. To roots rest. To battle. The glory. Let's go slay them by the thousands. Broad. We need to send a dragon. Where? Queen is back. To support the war that your vassals have been fighting in your absence. Your grace. <laughs> oh, you got some sass to you today, huh? I went to King's Landing. To what possible end? To meet Queen Alicent and soon. Hey, like, why would you do that? You saw Alicent. Yes, I did. You could have been taken or slain. I inherit either I win my claim or die. We Come on, ready. Sound the mount up right near. Need to send a dragon. Mm-hmm. Burn them all. I will go. My queen. You cannot. I will not lose dragons to war whilst I hide here in my castle. Our allies raise their banners for you, mother. Yes, they do. If you die, all is lost. You must send me, your grace. Ah, yes, the OG dragon rider right Maybe there. She got mileage. No stranger to battle. Come on, burn him to a quest. So crispy. Sunfire. The gold and the most beautiful dragon in the world. The Targaryen. A dragon of gold paint on the belly. It's not just ordained to lead this. She said, about time, I ain't burned nobody up in years. Chose me That's all they gotta do. Stay on the battlements. They got some bows and stuff. Just to try to pick them off. I would say my arrow fire when they get a little closer, my though. You know they come in like no need to waste arrows. Meant to be this protector. But come on, Maylis. Realm, I had to send the dragons to war. That is why I must believe what Viserys told me. Sun fire is so her. beautiful. What Jaehaerys had told him. And what I want the song of ice and fire. Oh my. Come on, rain it down. If it, oh, they still got another mounted force in the back? 1500 force? Oh, shit, Jack. Run for your lives, man. Run! Run! Come on. That's a veteran in the saddle right there. Burn him! Burn him all! <laughs> no, 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 that old bitch! That old bitch! Wait, what? He gonna let Aegon take the fight? Oh my god. They are so unlucky. Forward, Sunfire! Come on, Sunfire the Golden! What man of House Targaryen! Your king has joined you! Hold to your courage! Hold to your mm -hmm. wits! It's the Hold perfect time for that mother out of fire! This house with divine purpose for the one true king, Aegon! Dagon! Dagon! I'm not even part of the graves. I'm not. I'm on Maylis. The dance is finna start. Dragon on dragon. <laughs> Use a flame. Behind you, boy. Oh, I'm the nigga. Oh, I'm the Oh my god, no, no, so sorry, it's so beautiful! Ah! 
Oh my god! The blood is so hot! No! Melly's oh, Melly's whooping our ass! No, 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 not Bay God! Keep that old bitch at bay, please! No, no. Vasenia's mount. She has seen battle after battle. This is a seasoned veteran, the most seasoned of them all. The biggest dragon in Westeros. The old queen, Vega. Fight the guns! <laughs> You better be happy for your brother. She gonna get them both? Oh my god! So fire! You coming to Oh my god! Oh, she gonna finish it. She ain't no coward. Tell him who the rightful queen should have been. She putting her straps on. She's ready for battle. There go, Vega. Come on, slay that old bitch. <laughs> Vega, like, damn, that's ass. A little bit of competition. <laughs> oh, that easy? Get in the wall. Come on, come on, get in the wall. Oh, no, no, it's too much fire. Oh, it's so beautiful! It's so tragic! Oh, that big fish just landed on everybody! Oh my, it is a shit show! But it's beautiful! <laughs> They got in her prime, she done got wounded, she mad than a motherfucker. They know it ain't over. They said one more ride, baby. One more ride. Let's go out in the blaze of glory. Let's go out like a dragon rider. Oh my God. She's so sneaky! No, 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 Mary. You bastard! You bastard, Eamon! You goddamn can slayer! Cole, you know, you lucky. You are so lucky, Cole. Oh, who is that? Oh, it's so much chaos. Just a just an open field of roasted men and poor horses. Some good lads, some good steeds. But what are they supposed to do against the dragon? Is Aegon dead? He went down hard in an explosion. He got to be burnt to Chris. I think it's just like, it got to be just like in the bush where his armor just melted into his body and his skin. The king has fallen, we must find him. I just really hate to see the soldiers like that die because it's like they really have nothing to do with this petty war. They just live around these parts and just forced to do these things. Amen. Don't oh you can slay her. He is thirsty for blood. What are you aiming? The series demon of a crazy? child. Where is it? Oh my.
And this dance that just started, this is just the second dragon on dragon. <sighs> Man. Oh, Corley's no. <laughs> Oh, I feel, I feel so bad for the man. Oh, he is beaten down. He lost the love. It's true love. The love of his life. He has lost everybody he has loved and cared for because of that goddamn house Targaryen. <laughs> That's all they can get? They finna bring Melees to the city. The traitor dragon Melees slain at Brook's rest by your king, Tuagon. Y'all just love y'all propaganda, huh? They know this ain't right. Don't they realize we won the battle? Strange victory. If it was one. He's telling the truth. We then have lost our king in this battle. Like, did we really win? I thought the dragons was gods. Even the gods fall sometimes, son. Even the gods. Those corpses still up there hanging? Y'all not gonna take them down? Where the food rations is right now? Surprised they ended up in a bowl of brown. <laughs> Just chest up, chin up. He is proud about it. Is Aegon in there? Oh, that is Aegon. I want to see him. I want to see him so bad. Little charred up body. Blackfire survived, of course. Valyrian steel. I was sure looking for Blackfire. I'm like, why he ain't going to war with Blackfire? I'm mostly just saying the dagger, but he, I guess he did. Is he alive? His oh. grace remains with us. Oh my god, he is a monster. Oh, oh they have to cut the armor off. It's just like the birds! Oh my god! The armor was burnt to his skin! Oh my god! Hey god! Is my son going to die? I'm afraid I cannot say. Now, if you'll excuse me, Your Grace, these next hours are most critical. Just give them some space, Allison. Just let them do their magic. Oh my god! Oh! Eamon! You massacred your brother! Oh, wow. Someone will have to rule in his stead. Let me guess, it's you, huh? What happened? We took the castle. I left a meager garrison behind to protect. She don't care about that castle. Yeah. What happened to her son? Her, her son, long. her firstborn. And Amon? That's a monster. You raised a monster when you birthed Amon. Kristen Cole marches about the Crownlands unchallenged. Duskin down, and Rook's rest are gone. All you do is bitch. We still have no ground army, but the one we hope that Damon will raise. He who has left us after some marital spat. Do you take Whoa. issue with me, Sir Alfred? This is your queen! My lord, it is merely that the gentler sex heretofore has not been much privy to the strategies of battle or their execution. There has been peace in our lifetime. You've seen no more battles than I have. She got a point about that. She is right about that. What 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 you been? You ain't go to the damn stepstones. You went out there with Damon and Corlys and Lainor. Time is ripe. If we can strike King's Landing before that dragon is recovered, then I myself must do it. My queen, you are the crown. It is out of the question. What would you have me do? Somebody else need to mount up. Taron Hall. To treat with Damon. See your stepdaddy. This is for them. He must affirm his loyalty to my mother and report his standing. As he should. I gotta give it up to Jace. He's standing on business. The Freys, they control the crossing at the Twins. Craig and Stark's Greybeards are marching south. 
If his men had a direct route into the Riverlands, we would not have to wait for Damon to act. How was they going to cross anyway? To secure it. By boat? Taking it is not a united force in the Riverlands, so I understand this. The hour is late. <laughs> Damon and Karastis! You have no choice but to submit. <laughs> Bend the knee to me. Or your house burns. That's simple. I'd sooner be the Lord of Bones and Cinders than bend my knee before some heathen Blackwood. <laughs> I have dragon. Your brother's head keep on its way back to you, Willem. I've heard the maggots got to it. That is quite the impression, Lord Bracken. Rat him down. But alas, not an answer. We choose fire. Then fire it will be. Karasti's been waiting to burn some people alive. I did not think they would be so eager to die. <laughs> <They'd be very laughs> what did you think? They would rather burn than succumb. Exactly the kind of men I need. Exactly. That was awesome. Tough bastards. They yet be there are things the crown itself must not be seen to do. Show them your worst. I am your servant, your grace. I'm loving Damon in the Riverlands, trying to get all these knuckleheads in order. By force or by flame, baby. Over the centuries, the eerie? many and more armies have broken themselves against my bloody gate. A big one. And it's like feeling powerless. So do I. Do I need to go to Dragonstone and go find your mountain, Raina? Oh, they would make me queen, but they wish to keep me here, confined. They betray their own smallness. It's smart. We don't want from. our most viable asset to die. <laughs> Will you send to him? For too long I have looked to him for strength. If I must be supplicant to my own husband, what does that make me? Y'all are wife and husband. Y'all are married. Y'all posted Sorry. the pen on each other. Like, what's wrong with that? <laughs> They would be an asshole sometimes, but God, he, he still want to protect you now. Damon. Who was that? Damon. If only you'd been born first. My favorite son. Was that his goddamn mother? You need to stay out the drugs, Damon. Perhaps she could provide the necessary coin if you could only write to her. No. He said, I am not Heroin talking to her God. right now. I am single the for the moment. <laughs> so stop eating it! <laughs> I love them brothers. It's so goofy. <laughs> Has he woken? No. I must admit, I'm not sure he will ever wake. Our king's fate lies with the gods now must just allison pray the gods better look out for at least one time <laughs> the regency will assure the people of the stability of the crown did you have a candidate in mind your grace i myself served in this role for my husband i am well prepared to do it again you played your king does not lack for heirs the obvious choice is his immediate successor Prince agreed lord laris I agree, Your Grace. It must be Prince Aymond. It's the right choice. What would you say if, in response to Rhaenyra's crowning, we raised up a woman of our own? Aegon may may not make it. A. Hey, might as well get Aemon ready to rule now. You literally started a sexist war, and now it's happening to you is a problem. I, I don't feel sad for. <laughs> may have thought Viserys said something, but come on now, you know what they was up to the whole time. Then let the gates be closed. I would have been close in my opinion. Ain't nobody coming in and out this city after <laughs> my nephew got assassinated in his own bed. We closing the lost. gates. Ain't nobody leaving. Ain't nobody coming in. Someone cut down the fucking rat catchers. He's starting off good. Cutting down the rat catchers. The city's safe no longer. There is no food. Our neighbors are stealing from each other. We must get out. I really love the small folks POV this My season. Will have room. We you always need needed that. Like they the ones that suffer the most. Let's be for real. Mm -hmm. These are the people in the vanguard. Wow, she's so sick. <laughs> she is playing. Good run being sick. 
Do they have a sick at the award? So she might win it. <laughs> oh, where are you supposed to go now? Come on, let him come in. Let him be a household dog. Let him come in. You're going to get eaten out there in Fleet Bottle, man. It, it, it is rough out there. Presumed you'd be here. Seeing faithfully to the Prince Regent's commands. Please get this dog out the scene. It's not like a focus on. He's so cute. <laughs> Uh, I smell a riot. I smell a riot. You know these flea bottom people like zombies. They closed the gates, the round just started. <laughs> Fetch me their souls. Oh, she's so sick. She white. Oh my god. She is acting her ass off. <laughs> Vermax? Means death to bear steel against your liege. As I'm sure my prince is aware. Just like a and prey. against your queen? Our hesitance does not lie in Rhaenyra as queen, nor in the ruminations of Lord Tully, the oaf. <laughs> Our fear lies in Vagar. Do you offer us your protection? I do, and the protection of my uncle. Larys Strong has been relieved of his castle. Does the queen intend to raise up a new lord? You want to right with that? You probably right with that. Hair hall, y'all want hair hall, y'all can have it. You might die, but y'all can have it. What Damon gonna do when you find out you're taking this man cave? <laughs> <laughs> Go to war, Damon! What are you doing? <laughs> what was that? It is so creepy here. <laughs> he said, that's a creepy strong. bitch right there. <laughs> the Blackwoods have overwhelmed the Brackens, and uh, Lord Amos has pledged his banner to you. House Bracken is yours. About time, see my boy Corbs. My castle is a tomb. Empty. Haunted. Queen Rhaenyra wishes to name you Hand. Even the death of my wife does not content her. <laughs> like, what more does she want from she me? Of my house. And she flew to Rook's rest of her own will, in defense of her kin. And she died. She died as she would have wished to die. With honor, in dragon fire. And the way I myself wish to meet my end. No, no, Baylor. Got that swamp just like Damon. <laughs> You yourself may do as you see fit. Granddaughter. I would make you my heir. I am blood and fire. Driftmark must pass to salt and sea. I don't know, Baylor. Like the blood of the dragon. That was pretty cool, though. He tried to at least make one of his um grandkid daughters. Granddaughters. The heir. Oh my god, he is having weird dream after weird dream. The river lords have come, your grace. They wish an audience. Now? What godless hour is it? The wall. They are demanding to speak presently. I dare y'all wake up king this late. Is that the dude he beat up <laughs> when he first got there? Is there some reason you feel free to wake a king in his bed? House Bracken have been brought to heel at the hands of William Blackwood. That news is stale. The livestock was stolen and our peasants put to the sword. They pursued the women and the children. There were works of barbarity. Punishing Bracken for his own treasons is one thing, I. But these other acts. For of common decency. These beasts <laughs> proudly carried the banner of House Targaryen. We should have expected nothing more from a man who ordered the slaughter of a child in his mother's arms. Oh my god. How dare you that talk to Damon like this. Told it we shall not raise our banners for a tyrant. And get burnt to the crisp. I can care less. Oh, I gotta feel so bad, man. Is this lust for power over with? At the end, lost everybody you really love. You goddamn can't slay her. 
You are a serious demon of a child. Elaine? Was it worth the price? Losing the eye? Or killing your brother? Almost killing your brother. Kinda feel bad for Aegon. Oh, that's so sad. I'm <laughs> so sad. Visenya. Vagar's first rider. I hope you do not mean to use her as an example. Why shouldn't I? Well, it was a long time ago. <laughs> do you know who Visenya really was once Aegon was gone? <laughs> you might want to keep reading right now. <laughs> it is Lord Ch I love some Visenya, but. End, assuming. Whew. That bastard of a son, Nagor. And yet, I must wait here. Always prudent. Sending others to fight and be felled in my name. When Aemond comes hunting for you, your dragon is young. Will you fly before Vega is looted? Perhaps Damon could... <laughs> so don't mention that name right now. I'm still mad at that nigga. <laughs> Vega is big. But Cyrax is quicker. So was Melis. Melis fought two dragons and one of them is slain. We have two large enough to stand against Vega. They are called Vermithor and Silverwing. And they sleep just beneath our feet. Yes, and if only they had riders, none could stand against me. There are those of our line who never ruled. Those who married into other noble houses. Blood would be thin. And yet. The dragon will only accept a dragon lord to ride it. It's gonna find some dragon seeds. Are you suggesting we put a malister on a dragon? Atali. It's better than death and defeat. I don't know about this one. <laughs> there are records here, surely, of our line, and of those who fell out of it. Got the history right there. Got a read right near a read. It's a malister. There it is. Is this the Battle of Rooks Rest? Yeah, I believe so. Them Westermen, they ready to ride down on a bastard. Those golden lions. What's those in the cages? Prisoners? A livestock, maybe? You don't want your livestock escaping when you're on campaign. Uh, you got nothing to eat. Oh, you got a nice mounted force. Wait for the sack. Or is they showing up AA? I bring a thousand knights of my own, and seven times as many archers and men at arms. Is that a lion? We have finished with the Riverland scum. Y'all gonna just let a lion loose on the battlefield? Come on, my lord. Tell my brother we are ready to march. As soon as Prince Aemond is able to join us on <laughs> Vega. Yeah, I'm with him. If I'm gonna go to battle, I want a Prince giant Mace dragon in the air. Is my backup. He dares to summon me <coughs> with haste. It does seem I am the prince regent, not a dog to be called to heal. <laughs> tell you he said, I am a dragon rider, not some bitch of a hound. We will make an alliance with the triarchy. Say me? I've had enough of this cursed blockade. When that Adolf's job? <laughs> what has come of our letters to the Greyjoys? They have been to no avail. <laughs> the Red Kraken waits, seeking his best advantage. Yeah, that's what the Kraken do. Some goddamn ironborn raiders and pillagers. We would do better to await the High Tower host and set up. Yeah, I would wait for my men. To Fortnite's monster. Everybody ain't got a bit bad dragon like you ain't. And you yourself? My uncle is a challenge. I welcome. If he dares face me. Oh yeah, he oh he dares. Trust me, he doesn't even consider you the threat. He just talks about Vega when this situation comes up. Talk about the real Queen Regent Vega. Have <laughs> the indignities of your childhood not yet sufficiently been avenged? Gratitude. You raised them bastards. Don't be mad now. You raised them. Don't be on the news. I'm like, my baby ain't do nothing. <laughs> it's so empty. Like everybody, 
had a companionship with of his age just gone or Your grace. <laughs> I would feel so confident with Corey's there. A man that's been to war, actually fought wars. So Stephen Darkland, Your Grace. You said, well, I'm being summoned here. And I must not go to battle myself, as I am constantly told, lest I am slain or captured and with me are hopes of victory. Which makes sense. <laughs> Don't be giving them no snotty looks. That makes sense. I need more dragon riders for Vermithor and Silverwing and for Sea Smoke, who I believe misses his bond. The dragons here would not take her as a rider. Then who could do it? You. I am but a man. The dragons are gods. I love that they look to the dragons as, as gods. You <laughs> understand. That's opinion. perfect fantasy right there. <laughs> I swore to ward my queen with all my strength and to give my blood for hers. That is my oath, Your Grace. That's a real knight. Thank you, Sir Darkness. Ah, there's Damon the Spooky. In the throne room? There's a dream. Brother. Oh my god. Addy. Viserys. Sweet dear brother. Did you say it? The heir for a day. You should have been at my side. But instead, you chose to celebrate your own rise, laughing at me. Whore. Laughing with the whores and lace spittles. <laughs> you have no allies at court but me. I've been nothing but a brother to you, Damon. Why, Damon? Why? Ain't no escaping it, Damon. Are you gonna be a thrall and a slave to your nightmares, Damon? Old places are you mocking me. <sighs> sit! You three stooges, sit the f down. <laughs> you are an agent. Of you are tripping, Damon! You're great. With your club footed nephew, or is it Rhaenyra? No, 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 Damon, I'm doing it, please. Grace. He's such a sweet guy, Damon. Don't do him here. Calm down, my prince. Calm down, my prince. It's just a bad dream. Whatever your game is strong, I assure you, your king is on his guard. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, he is having a bad trip. Stop watching me. You need to leave, or he'd be a broken man. Yeah. Yes, he got his getaway bag. <laughs> Grass is like, hurry up! I'm ready to leave! This place spooky even for a dragon! The ghost of Hat in the Black mourning his curses from King Spire. He don't believe in that spooky shit! All of it! The ghost, the curses, the blasted weirwood bed, I'm done with it! Ah, uh, yes, it is. There are older things in this world than you or I or living memory. Even things older than the dragons. You are not the well, that's perhaps why your brother gave the crown to her. Perhaps those who strive for it are the least suited to wave it. Don't lecture me! Be careful with that tongue now when you talk to a Viserys prince. Viserys never wanted it. If you have any counsel for dealing with the river lords, I'd be glad of it. Let's start out taking Willem's head. I like Willem, but God, he went too far, man. Damn we gotta take his head. Asking for help? Counsel. Exactly, as a king needs. <laughs> but Grover Tully is their lord paramount. Without him, they will never raise their banners as one. Then I can do nothing. Give them that wisdom. You. No. Is that the owl she said she was? Do nothing now. In three days' time, the winds will shift. That's what Diamond needed. Now you finally help. Good shit. That's this song they sing. Come on, Sir Stephen, you got this, man. Do this for your father. Do this for your house. Oh, that's that song Damon was singing in season one, episode 10 ish. Yeah, 10. Yep, episode 10. Where's Drake is it gonna be? 
Pairi. Pairi. Lakiri. Let's see smoke. Riba. Say it with your chest. No hands. See smoke. Ooh, wait a minute. See smoke at his obey? Come on. Walk up boom. You gotta walk up like Aegon when he mountain Valerian. Stop being scared, man. <laughs> you ready? You gotta got the dragon mount ready for you. Come on. No, you haven't. You stop talking now. No, no, no! So Stefan, no! He was such a loyal knight. Diana, she is finna spill the tea for real. Oh, I was gonna find a dragon rider. Bit thin, isn't it? See that other fish. Nothing but fish in this damn city. All we can hey. catch right now is a blockade. My girls were taken to the Red Keep a few nights ago. Feasting and merriment for the new Prince Regent. <laughs> they were well paid and well fed too. Dang, she just spreading these rumors. Honey cakes, beef and gravy. Oh, that sounds so good. <laughs> there is to be another revel on the morrow with dancing. King Viserys loved his feasts and his wine, but never while our small folk went without. Hmm, aye. But he's gone now. Viserys is right a good man, a good king. He is bad. Oh! Tired of being washed up. To approach, true, not as sensational. Uh, his, his numbers were few, but we may yet retake. Slap the shit out of him. Shut up! Right near the crew. She pimp slapped that nigga. <laughs> right now, you ain't had to throw him like that. <laughs> he cannot destroy his own city. But can they overthrow him? Maybe not. But it is harder to wage war abroad when you must also keep peace at home. Mmm, thinking there. I like that. Then let us see to our plan. Fighting on two fronts, you can't do that. Even if you got a dragon, you can't fight on two fronts. You can't burn two fronts at the same time. Sheep for Vega. Oh, it's gonna be a riot. I'm smelling it right Don't now. Those Aegon's burns? See my brother. Uh. He's like, mm mm, mm mm. Yeah, where y'all going? Where y'all going? Come back, come back, please, come back, please, please come back. Help me. Oh, oh my God. What do you remember? Oh. <laughs> you so mean, Amen. You devil of a child. Yeah, he was just scared, because he was scared when he was walking up to the bed. He was squirming at his sheep. Not all of us, I suppose, are called to great deeds. Some Ooh, she's still sad. She is the emo girl on this show. Even if they are not the dragon's hater, themselves. a family hater. <laughs> Burnt sheep. There's been a dragon here? Sheep stealer. It's sheep stealer. There is a large dragon in the Vale. Rumor of it began shortly after the war, ranging more broadly for food. Okay, that makes sense. That makes sense why it's a dragon in the Vale. They gonna hunt for food. They are dragons. They can fly at their free will. Especially the ones on Dragonstone. The sea snake would sooner have high tide claimed by the sea than call us his sons. <laughs> He probably right Stop at this point. Wasting your life waiting for something that will never come. He might be young and arrogant, but man, I'm glad his brother 
hit him with some cold reality. Sometimes you gotta say the truth, people. And what did he say that was so deserving? I like Jay. Hey, See, he's trying to talk some sense to his mama. Like, calm um, down. What did he do for real? My queen, a gift is sent. What gift? What gift? Exactly, Jace. <laughs> Jace don't really like all this sneaky stuff that's going on. You want to fight this war with honor. I'm glad there's somebody that's like that on this show. Everybody's so sneaky. Jace, he ain't that sneaky. He really go out there and do stuff in front of the Lord's faces. Is that food? That's what you're supposed to do right near her. Is this food? Please let this just be food. Not no swords and <laughs> stuff like that, man. Pretty sure they got their own knives and dented swords. Oh, yes, food. Thank you, right there. Thank you. <laughs> That's how you become the queen. You got to look out for the small foes, the people on the ground, the people that's going to be picking up shields and swords and out there fighting for you. The realms, the light. Thank you. Thank you. It's multiple. Thank you, right now. That's why I'm saying black. House Beesbury has raised arms against the High Tower host. Oh. Retribution for their lord's demise. Yeah, that's kind of cold, folks. <laughs> All you had to do, Cole, was not kill one old man and you killed him. <laughs> it's like, now, nah, what can the small folk say against Rhaenyra? Okay, yes, yeah, she do have the blockade, but now she's feeding us, so it's kind of like on y'all now. Nah, it's y'all fault. Y'all got to be doing something wrong. My son, Daryl, what's he like? <laughs> Ten and six now. He's 16? He's stored. Clever. As a depth with his loot as he is with his sword. I want to see Daron this season. At least once. He's kind. That's what we need. That's all we need. What's happening? Food for near a ship's shit. Her kind of shore in the middle of the night with gifts from the Queen. Woo! Thank you, Queen, right now! Damn! He just poked him. Come on, get back to your family, y'all. I can blame him. That's a hungry man that got a sick daughter and a hungry wife at home. Hey, you got to do what you got to do out here. Grace, we must leave now. Mm, uh, we need some more gold flows here. Oh, no. Oh. <laughs> Protect the queens! What are y'all doing? No. Is this an A goal? That's an A goal. I know it was an A goal. The A goals ain't no hell. You got one king's guard out there for real. No, 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 no! Please leave Elena alone. Please leave Elena alone. Let's start swinging your sword, mate. That was the A goons getting beat up. <laughs> Laying a beat on them A goons. Long live Queen right near her. The Rams delight. But get her lining up out of there. I don't care. Y'all gotta cut them down at that point. Just get her lining up out of there. You just need to get the sage mask right now. <laughs> hey, he does scared it. <laughs> he said, Help me, bro. Get me up out of here, mate. <laughs> Brother. Oh, uh, it's serious. David, she's gone. <laughs> <laughs> Exactly, you should have been by your brother's side, man. I'm sorry. This is what we need all along. This is that great character we need. <laughs> Sorrowful news from 
Riverrun, my king. Lord Grover is dead. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Let's get this war started. Riverrun's maesters have been at their wit's end. Our own healer, Alice Rivers, volunteered her renowned skills. She poisoned that man. You're like, thank you. Thank you. I don't look like a loser no more. Thank you. <laughs> I've been crying for his brother, probably. Sea smoke? What, what, what you doing, Sea smoke? Calm down, buddy. No, he's been in the block. He's been in the block. Hey, Sea smoke, calm down, bro. <sighs> you playing? I guess it's a fun game of catch. <laughs> Don't look back, you know you're in the sky. <laughs> what is it? Oh my god! Hey, uh, can we talk about this sea smoke? Hey, uh, hey, uh, hey, uh, hey, come on, calm down, bro. Calm down, come on, come on. Look here, look here. <laughs> you kind of look like laying on a little bit. I think you are tired. My own son questions my capabilities. <laughs> I'm not giving the whole plan, that's why. Damon himself. He has he ever done, done what suits Damon. He was everything I wanted to be. <laughs> this really is the Damon hate club. And I was. He wished to possess me, but not to be possessed. Prince Damon is nobody's mouth. You have me. <laughs> you have my thanks. You really trying to get up in there real close? I'll keep my eye on her. I'm sorry, I never trust any master of whispers. That's just Game of Thrones hard. logic. Don't trust them. Their job is to be sneaky. <laughs> because of that, I will serve you. I believe you are meant to be queen. Oh, I thought she was <laughs> going for the kiss. Oh, shit, now. <laughs> So you smell like Dragon Cologne number five, baby. Give me 20 minutes of this right now. I need it. Right near it, and found a new mount. This is going to be awesome when Damon. <laughs> Begging your pardon. The Dragon Sea Smoke has been sighted flying over Spice Town. Yes, he does that. From what we have heard, he has a right. This is what you want right now. Calm down. This is somebody that, that probably be on your side. She said, F, but I'm mounting up myself. Right now, it's having no business this episode. I'm loving it. Chase, mount up with us. <laughs> what Birdman said, you ain't that far? This that Targaryen badasses I'm talking about. <laughs> Oh, a showdown for the century. It's been a long time. Still miss me, baby. <laughs> it gotta be like Cyrus as far as baby daddy, sea smoke. You stand before the queen of the seven kingdoms with a dragon of House Targaryen. Let know right now. Boy, what you doing up on that night? Learn the ways of dragon riders and to serve my queen. Oh my god, they starting the loyalty off already. This dragon came to me, not I to him. I have sweated. He said he took me. Please teach me how to ride it. I may appear lowborn. And if the gods call me... You said, wait a minute, your ass look like callers, boy. Come, he came humble. You have done something. I feared impossible. Adam of Hull. I like that she kind of impressed by this. I'm glad of it. Do you think you can get him to Dragonstone? I can try. 
at least teach me a few flying words real quick. I, I like that happy right now. We don't get to see that smile a lot. So. <laughs> I haven't seen that smile since last yeah. season. The volume is low to the cage. The wall. He sent them to the wall. Well, they started a riot. Took their cloaks? That is, is they other friend that dead? Cause they had him on the ground. I don't know where he at. But you are better served looking under the sheets and in the wood piles. Mm hmm. Yeah, look for them bastards right near them bastards. I once worked in a pleasure house where generations of Targaryen princelings had their revels. Perhaps some here on Dragonstone, the misbegotten offspring of your house. And dragon seeds. You speak of the lowborn. They are as like to serve you as highborn lords or ladies, perhaps more. I wish to ask for leave to relinquish my part as a shipwright in your service. There are good men and strong who can take my place. You said, shut up, boy. What, what the hell are you doing here? You know I didn't claim you. What are you doing here? Granted. You're going to be a good father, Corliss. Please. It ain't too late. It's never too late, Corliss. Well done. That's it. <laughs> I take it. That's a start. Them tallies. Honor. Duty. Family. Lord Diamond. The crown congratulates you on your ascension to the head of your house and Lord Paramount in the Riverlands. Truly glorious. Well done. I did nothing. Nevertheless, <laughs> which is the important thing. So my grandfather died. Before recognize the authority of the named heir, Queen Rhaenyra, and your own as her king consort. Thank you. Somebody remember their oaths and honors. <laughs> Come along, Lord Oscar. So let me teach you how to be a lord. <laughs> you are a pupil and a disciple of Damon's not. Get your notepad out, taste some tips. In the deepest darkness comes the dawn. The deepest darkest depths of Mordor? Oh, he here? Why did you come here? I want to came. <laughs> Be welcome. Grey Batali is dead. Lord Oscar raised up in his place. You have been summoned here to swear anew your fealty to him. And mm -hmm. as his brother men, answer Time to bend some knees. Call. And what would... And I have no love for Daemon Targaryen. He has dishonored himself and the crown with his comportment here. Oh, you bold and now? Having is to defer to the so I'm like, uh, uh, we might be in the sticks this way. When he named Rhaenyra his heir. I see no reason to cast aside loyalty. No matter how loathsome I may find her representative, the prince. King. <laughs> Mind your tongue, boy. <laughs> what you gonna do to Damon? Caress is where you at? Is he finna stand no business? Will you have our army or not? He said, I'm, I'm, I'm playing the suckers here. You better fall in line, Damon, for once. <laughs> once, Damon. Your Lord Oscar is bold. I may have been a touch enthusiastic in pursuing my aims, but don't allow my failings to keep you from supporting an upright man Lord. i wouldn't lay my sword at his feet just yet i accept you as my vassal but i am lord paramount of all river houses and there is only one answer for the crimes you visited upon your neighbors exactly all for this head but you did not have to pursue such savagery. You did it because you wanted to. Exactly. It's that lifelong beef y'all got with these people. Seize him. Your grace, command them. I've only served you. You want to look too far, baby. Them. If his grace wishes we do war, him. not war crimes. He must now rectify his grievous error. Denounce your crimes. And dispense justice. Oh dear. They gonna hang him? <laughs> Simon's so extra with it. No, no, no. 
Damon, you know what you got to do. I've been faithful. Off with his head with Dark Sister. Dark Sister went smooth, cleanly through like butter. <laughs> oh my God. Not old Viserys, no. I never wanted it. All that pain it caused. The crown ruined his life. It crushes whoever wears it. Do you want it still? The king of flea bottom. Do we really want the crown? Or do we just seek glory? I can't. Oh, he walking? Good job, a guy. Don't let your brother see this. <laughs> oh no! I can't. I can't. No, 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 no. Oh, look, he's having a friend. Why are they making me like them so? <laughs> I do not want to like them. They are so creepy. <laughs> Ooh, I would curse my brother every day. Every day I would curse his name. I would live my life full of hatred. <laughs> so I gotta talk to you about your brother real quick. I have tasks that need your personal attention. The queen has found a new rider for one of her dragons. I've heard tell of it. The rider is your brother. She now makes the call for others. I am of salt and sea. I yearn for nothing else. Go ahead and make him Lord Corliss, please. Make him Lord. This is an honorable young man. Commander of your Queen's Guard, heir to the Dunfall. These people are courageous. Mongrels. <coughs> House Targaryen is the blood of the dragon. If any may lay claim to it, what are we then? What if one of your base-born, silver-haired dragon riders decides he wants to rule the Seven Kingdoms? Did the Conqueror's dream foretell that? <laughs> what else? He's sassy this episode. Proceed and it's understandable. We're left in the dark on a lot of things. And he's the heir to the throne. He shouldn't be. Fly against Vega myself. I may take my rightful place on my father's throne. And when you die? So I'm going to have to deal with the you war and the fallout. But this is so understandable. Like, Did you think somebody with a bigger dragon, they get a big ego. They might think they should be king. When you took Harwin Strong into your bed, did you think I might favor him, or did it not cross your mind? Terrorists. I'm no fool, mother. The proof is here for all to see. Yet I may argue my legitimacy to succeed you because I have a dragon. And now you say you'll strip that from me too. <sighs> wow. That's a good saying from Jace. Finally spoke his truth. I mislike all of this. I don't pursue it. Exactly. Don't do it right there. Fight with honor. Whatever you must, you see that it fights her. Hmm? He's sneaking into the city? What's going down? Oh, secret message. What, the, what they gonna kick up? Oh, they looking for them silver-haired bastards. Word is, Rhaenyra's recruiting small folk to go to Dragonstone. They're looking for Targaryen bastards. Boats leave tonight. How of the bat? Seven hells off. This is it. <laughs> you said I was just lying. I was just joking, right? No, I can't be sure it's all true. The time has come. Come on. Can I see a little? He said, You're a Baylon's bastard. Come on, boy. Yes. Yes, there is. That's Baylon's bastard. Yeah. Yeah. Come on. Yeah. To the, to the boys. That's Baylon's bastard. Baylon's bastard. Baylon's bastard. The Baylon's bastard. The Baylon's bastard. I don't want you to go. I have to, Cat. Can't ignore this. I never knew my father. Not much is true. But I did know my mother. Is he a, from you. a son of Sarah Targaryen? I'm sorry for that. The one that 
went out to go be a, a whore somewhere. She worked in a pleasure house. It is, Sarah. She was granted more freedom than most. She used to tell me I was no different to her brother's boys, the Sarahs and Damon. It is, Sarah's bastard. <laughs> I was ashamed of her. I could not keep our girl alive. She gone? She died? I do not care to be a lady, Hugh. And neither do I want to be a widow. That's understandable, because these dragons can eat you, or you, or you can claim a dragon and die in this war. You gotta feel both sides. I feel Hugh's side too. Like, I've been base born, low born all my life. This, being a blacksmith is probably the most peak I'm gonna get at this position, trying on my on without opportunities popping up like this. When else is, am I ever gonna become a lord or a dragon rider? This is my one opportunity I might as well go for it. Them dragon seeds, got them silver haired bastards. He said some of these might be Damien's, some of these might be Viserys, some of these might be Baylon's. <laughs> some of these might be Sarah's. <laughs> Exactly. Let them know. I'm down with the dragon keepers. They on strike. The dragon keepers on strike. I didn't even know they had a union. <laughs> But yeah, you gotta respect the old magic, man. This is just so disrespectful. To the dragon keepers that look at this like a religion, this is highly disrespectful to them. I mean, I'm not gonna die. But I'm here to see Verma throw away you at, big buddy. <laughs> you big bronze bastard. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm ready to see him. <laughs> He's like, Silverwing, I'll be right back. I'll roast a few niggas real quick. Oh my god, how big is this bastard? <laughs> now, this is a dragon. Oh, we got a battle style in the front of this Is that from that one day Donish War, or did another dragon do that? Maybe the cannibal. <laughs> I'm loving the bond. You're a good boy. You're a good boy, right? You're a good boy. Who among you would be first? Will we see um Megor's bastard? I want to see Megor's quote unquote bastard. Uh, <laughs> this is some scary shit. This is scary as hell, man. <laughs> Burma throwing ain't finna yield to no simp. You better be bold with it. Come on. Oh my god! Oh my god! Holy crap! Holy shit! I said, y'all, who the fuck gonna ride me? Oh my god! Oh! He said, I did not want to wake up for this bullshit, but I will feast. I will feast, though. Oh my god! He's so big! He said, Thank you, right now, I didn't expect the buffet today! <laughs> Oh, <laughs> say yum 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 yum. Say right, you feel go back to Silver Rain like right here. It's so nice. You just gave me a whole buffet full of people. <laughs> oh my God, it's so big. I'm ready. Mm, that's what you gotta be. You gotta be bold. With your chest out. Come on! 
Is he finna bend, bend to that bravery? Ah, oh, he obeying. Good boy. You the hammer. Sarah's Bastion, got by McCoy. Her father's dragon. Oh, it's so poetic. It's so poetic. Her father's dragon. Her bastard got her father's dragon. Oh my god. That's good right there. That's good. That's good. What are you finna see? The cannibal silver wing. Grey ghost. Dragon is be careful, you idiot. You just heard our babies. Like, I know, I know, I know. Nah, we'll get it over with. Who is that? Silver Wing or the Cannibal? That's Silver Wing. Just trying to play? Come on, all we want to play. Let me get a good smell of you. Yeah, yeah, you Baylon's bastard. Come here, boy. And he get his grandmother's dragon. You gotta mount it first. <laughs> he says, it's true, it's true, it's true, thank you. <laughs> Staren's dragon to Sarian has at last taken to wing. Ooh. Your brother expects to join the fight soon. He even mounted up himself. Everybody mount up this episode. Dragon inside? What? A dragon inside? Hold on. Who's that? Silverwing? Oh, I've been the block with Silverwing. He said, hold on. Let me show y'all something real quick. Hey, man, you better go mount up. Hurry up, charge, boy! They go, oh, what the hell is that? Let go that old bitch. <laughs> the singest bitch of a mount. Oh my, you better run off. They got come on, let's, let's get at it right now. They got like, man, you, you say you, she say you, just hell for singing with a sled on. <laughs> oh, she got some riders now. Time to go to war. The triarchy? And the sea. Tragoroha! A monkey? This is, this is fantasy, baby. It's the step stones. We will impose a simple tax on those passing through. Very well. This is if y'all don't say yes, Eamon finna be off with my head. Please, I'm begging y'all. Please, man. <laughs> Commander of our fleet must agree to go with you. His name is Lohar. The sailors are fiercely loyal to him. If, if he does not lead them, they will not fight. It's Tylen. What sort of man are you? Uh, I'm a golden man. lion, baby. <laughs> I will not sail with a man who cannot best me. I'll beat the fuck out of you, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Vega. Oh, what town did he set to a crepes? They said, no, 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 Vega, don't spin the block one more time. No, Vega. Some rump wasn't good, miss. Boy, you look like Kane when he took the mask off. <laughs> so what was the f point in all this, then? The gods are cruel, your grace, but I... Uh, Ask your mama that. Ask your grandfather that. They the ones who got you in this situation. Yes, he made a lot of dumb mistakes, but he wasn't trying to go for the throne himself. His father didn't die and say, forget Rhaenyra, I want the throne. He was somewhere out drunk and hard. angry. There's no telling. Take me to my throne. Once he returns, I shall take him prisoner. 
When Rhaenyra descends on you with her seven dragons and you without Vagar, what then? Ross on fire, the gold and the most beautiful dragon. Moved the greater part of Harren Hall's gold reserves to the Iron Bank in Bravos. We can live well and remain until what is coming has passed. You want to take me to Essos to live with the goat? <laughs> oh my god! My dragon is dead. I am burnt. Not Sunfire? And alone. He was such a good boy. I'll be Sunfire. Let your brother and the pretender destroy themselves in blood and bitterness when they are asleep or return. And the people will rise up to meet us. I can you think they will welcome of endless two monsters as king in hand? Fear. You know how precious Hail these people the is in, <laughs> in Westeros? It's so bad, bad, man. The Rams, the light, you gonna steal right near a shit. <laughs> Oh, Jace is hater of the year now. <laughs> Remove your feet from the table. I'd rather not. Ulf. It's not up to you. Ulf. Who's it up to then? Boy. Oh, those inner dragons coming out already. You said cousin. Look at that hair. He is acting so funny. Dragon riders both. You and I. Cut from the same cloth. <laughs> he still so validated. If you hinder our efforts through sloth or unreadiness, I will see you hanged and your body fed to the dogs in the street. Oh my God! You are tripping, Jace. What is wrong with you? This is Damon. This is little Damon right here. <laughs> you are ready. You have six dragons under your banner. My ships sail at your command, and my men serve you. You must crush this beast at its head and before too many days have flown. Be right. There is, of course, That's what a good hand giving good plan. advice. Your grace, a word. It seems the sheep I was Piper. has been sold up river. My vassals have sent a drove of swine instead. You've arrived just in time to see my new army. Mm -hmm. We came just in time. It's, it's very large. And in times like this, did you hear something? This place will have you barking at the moon. <laughs> Thank you, Damon ain't the only crazy one. <laughs> if you declare yourself, your lords will follow you. Simon, you use your return cloak. But what we need in this moment is a king. Please do not go back to your own ways, Damon. <laughs> do not let him drag you down to the gutter. We don't discuss treachery in front of Wellwoods. It's going to bed. The crown has need of your service. Now. The pretenders raise new riders against us and we must answer in kind. I need you to fly with Trim Fire to battle. And. <laughs> you that desperate man. Leave Elena alone. It isn't a question. They have defiled our birthright, made hey, commoners hey, into dragons. It's hey, a sin and must be punished. Hey, you not even smooth with it like Damon. But tender. And you see now what? And now you seek to corrupt your sister. Of all our line, the gentlest and most deserving of your protection. Who will protect her if she cannot protect us? And who will she be if her mind is broken? It is no longer our rule that is threatened. Our very lives. Would you not have us prevail? Not like this. I don't get both sides of the arguments. Like we as at war, we could die any second, and she don't not mount up. Like but. This. Elena is very sweet and shouldn't be at war, in a war at all. Maybe he should have came in a better approach, kind of sweeter. Oh my God! Mud wrestling, Tyler, fight back, defend yourself. I love to try these triumphy people. They're so colorful. I don't love them like as a person, but like they look, they're so colorful. It's just like y'all was now. Color just ain't show up when movies showed up. King's Landing has sent a most doubt. He was fighting for his life. <laughs> I said, oh, that's right. That's right. I'm a golden lion, baby. Big lion. Call me Tiger. Betwixt the wind and water. Hoist me, lads, and hoist again. Salute the captain's daughter. Bravo, bravo. About time we got a song this season. About time. Bravo! I will be pleased to sail at your side. 
and my captain is with me. Mm-hmm. And secure the little decent army. You are a handsome man, and you have proven your worth and virility. You trying to fuck I wish to have children by you. Come on. We in medieval times. I'll probably never go see you again. Let's, let's do this right now, baby. <laughs> Me too. Indeed. I want you to fuck my wives. That sounds like a great plan. The first plan sounded beautiful, but this plan sounds awesome. <laughs> More wine here. Timing. I'm getting towed up to the flow up. Free wine on command. <laughs> I was living it up. Oh, and some more of these little birds. That Lord Corliss is right. We must strike while we have the advantage and end this war. The strongholds of the usurper, Old Town and Lannisport, and their armies all must be subdued. Brenda. You wish for us to kill. Innocence. And so many. It is hard. But it cannot be helped. Right near the crew. We must break the What about Vega? She is fearsome. I'll take him on myself. Silver <laughs> wings are going, ah! We're afraid of nothing. There will be time enough he to say which one of us. We're is like it's a special bond now. Him and Silver Wings at the end. A knight will comport himself with grace at the Queen's table. Best make me a knight then. This is what happens when you, you let the yourself. scum of Fleet Bottom at your table. There is a message from Harren Hall, Your Grace. About time. Damon and Rhaenyra back together Damon? again. I need it. But Sir Simon fears treachery. Simon, you are a snitch. I won't allow it. Adam, come with me. You like, I can't even go see my stepfather. What? Man, oh. <laughs> I hate it here. I'm going to the God's Wood. What you finna do there, Creepy? I feel like something magical when it happens. <laughs> what the hell? What, what the? What in the seven hells? Was that an What was that by the Wellwood tree? I swear, I swear I've seen an animal or something. But today you are ready. What are you finna see? He finna, he finna work or something? Hold on. What, what, what's going on? Did she make a sacrifice to it already? Or was that Damon's sacrifice? That was my Willem's head. Who's on the phone? Right near First time seeing him. <laughs> How the hell do you hear the light up? What the? What the hell? <laughs> you know what you must do. <laughs> it's the type of magic I've been needing. And if I refuse, will you burn me as you did Egon? Yeah, she know about that. You should have known what she knew about I that. Lie. I saw it. You'll be dead. You were swallowed up in the god's eye. And you were never seen again. I'm so happy she just opened with this now. Like, everybody's gonna be creeped out. <laughs> she has scared two people so far. The <laughs> rest is like, hold on, wait a minute. Is that my baby mama? He said, hold no, who that new nigga you got with? Hold on. <laughs> nice land right there. The realm's the light. Sorry, right, say, I'm right here. What's up? <laughs> like, pardon of the Red Sea. <laughs> Watch out for your prince, your king. Say, what you want? You bring me a lunch? <laughs> And to whom are you sworn? Oh, put him on front street. You better bend the knee, Damon. Who sent up the lyrics of the war? Filibasma, Kesu, Pranon, Nerisa, Solar Nazis, Soprumi Vejume. 
He had a dream. The realm's only hope is a leader who can unite it, and my brother chose you. The Honorable Prince Damon, the Rogue Prince. He would never turn against his wife. You are the true queen, Rhaenyra. They even made me bend the knee in this motherfucker. All this for you, baby. I give you the world. And Damon. In the early Cridrujas, Separ Morogulias. Nuki cost on Tabor. Say, I'd never leave you, baby. Silula. <laughs> my queen. I can't get away from you. Even my mom, too. Off the war then. For every one of us who falls, a hundred of them, there will be no mercy. Lead him, Damon. For our queen. Lead him, Damon. Lead him, Damon. Lead him, Damon. Come on. Lord, come on. Let's die. Let's die by the thousands. Let's die by the thousands. Trying to help you. Is this the help you offer after all these years? A reminder to be grateful. I mean no offense. You may go. <laughs> do you know what it was like for you us? You are a terrible father. <laughs> do you know what hunger does to a boy? What grief does? Shame. You are dismissed. I don't know about some small folks' problems. I don't know. From cold dawn until sunset. And now that boy is dead. And his sister before him. And the other took his place. And now, now, now you remember I live. He said, you owe me, man. I, I've been needing this. Just let it all out, bro. I serve you because I must. But if it is all the same, I will decline any offers of help. I do not believe my father would have wished this. He left you with no choice. No, he went to just. court sick, cobbled his ass up on that throne and said, this is my heir. What are y'all doing? I will she never change my prevail. mind. Y'all are tweaking. <laughs> I had to see you. How, how, how the hell did you get here? <laughs> this is stupid at this point. This is stupid at this point. How did the queen regent? <laughs> Sneak off the dragon's throne. I don't care how close it is. How do they let that happen? Even she is not a dragon rider. My husband, my father, my lover, no, my son. The incorruptible queen sullies herself with a lover. The last talk at the scepter should have been the last talk between them two trying to stop this war. It's too you late. You alone made virtue your Both y'all people have burnt thousands. You. Alicent, you said it yourself. Blood has been shed. Cities burned. Armies. Why have you come here? Yeah, why? Please tell me why have you come Everyone here. Everyone will soon fly to join Cole in the Riverlands. When he's gone, Helena as queen will be the crown's authority. If you come then to King's Landing, I will see to it that our guards throw down their arms. We will open the gates. We will shed no blood. Okay, this makes sense. Thank you. You will enter as a conqueror. <laughs> Thank you. What of Egon? Oh, we should have started with this. <laughs> he has many faults, but. He still heeds his mother. I believe I can prevail upon him to bend the knee. No, indeed. still, you defend him. Still, you That's imagine a you can have. If I am to take the throne, I must put an end to the opposition. Amon, Amon, gotta die. You and Elena can live. A son for a son. That's that Valyrian blood sacrifice. I know. <laughs> I am at last myself. With no ambition greater than to walk where I please and to breathe the open air. You do that plan. I got you. A distant dream. Oh, off the war we go. I need it. Put it in me. Put it in me. I need war. I need war. I need dragon war. I don't care. I need record war. Give it to me any type of way. <laughs> These dragon riders getting ready, armoring up, mounting up. <laughs> Getting ready for battle. Hurry up, Raina! 
Hurry up! <laughs> the high tower on. It's a serious. The blue queen, baby! <laughs> Prince Damon gonna burn some up live. <laughs> that nice force. Oh, they hit King's Land. Chief Stealing. We got Otto! Who the hell got Otto? Ah, oh, they got up out of there. They bailed out. Alright, good thing for Larry's. Thanks for watching, everybody. If you want to see a fuller, uncut reactions, go on here and subscribe to my Patreon. The link should be in the description below. I will see you all for Duncan Ed, hopefully. And hopefully we can get wins winner next year. Maybe end of this year. I don't know. Hopefully we can get it before the next season of House of Dragon. I would love to talk about that with y'all. But other than that, thanks for watching. See you next time. See you for Duncan Ed. And also, before we start Duncan Ed, remember this for these for this next year. Just keep this quote in your heart. Keep it in your mind. How many eyes does Lord Blood Raven have? A thousand eyes and one. Up the lazy river with a robin song Wakes a bright new morning we can loaf along